All right, let's do a run and um, use a completely different strategy this time. That sounds fun. Let's try something completely different. Now we have an additional character. I'm so torn. Do we try the new character or do we try a different deck strategy with the same one? I'm just so curious what the new character is going to be like, though. Let's see. Oh, the silent. A deadly huntress from the Froglands eradicates foes with daggers and poison. Um, Ring of the Snake. At the start of each combat, draw two additional cards. Whoa. So the downside, though, is we don't gain a whole bunch of HP constantly. Hmm. That one starts with... This one also starts with 10 less HP. They both start with 99 gold. Let's try, let's try out the new one. <laughs> Green Mario. Embark. Ooh. Uh, greetings. I am... Oh, this was... This was the thing that we heard about in our um, cursed book that we found. Greetings, I am Meow. <laughs> I don't think that's the sound it makes. Greetings, I am Meow. At least confront the first boss. Wait, I did beat the first boss. Wait, uh, enemies in your next enemies in your next three combats have one HP or max HP plus seven. Well, max HP plus seven will help me in the long run. Um, so, next three combats have one HP. Ah, I'll take the max HP. That'll help me in the long run. Seven's not that much though, but sure. Granted. Cool. Now we have buffs. So I'm assuming as you progress in the game, you get more buffs and things, making this a rogue light instead of a rogue like specifically. Um. All right. I am currently standing up. I'm gonna go back to sitting, and then we will continue. Standing up. Three hours. shall find out. I'm already addicted. Send help. All right, let's do it. Can I fight two of the elites? Yes, I can. Most paths actually let me fight two elites this time, it seems like. You can even fight three. Oh my gosh, I can fight three elites. Let's do it. Let's fight three elites. Let's go this way. <laughs> this character has your favorite card. Yeah, so we do have a completely different card set strike though it is kind of similar for those starting cards right um this is a really bad one more run game yeah i'm not surprised i'm not surprised all right i got two slammy slams we only have three oh yeah that's right we start with three energy geez we draw so many cards uh deal three damage apply one weak probably want to do that to the one that's going to do more damage so but maybe i can finish this one off Two strikes will finish this one off. So let's neutralize this one to make it deal less damage to us. What's Survivor do? Gain eight block. Ooh. Maybe in that case, I will strike this one twice to just finish it off. And then I'll just use Survivor so I don't take any damage. That sounds like a good way to do it. All right, it doesn't matter what I discard. So I'll just block the whole thing. Yeah. One more run into 10, turns into 10,000s of hours. <laughs> All right, it's gonna do seven damage and apply a debuff. So maybe I should, I don't know how bad the debuff's gonna be. Um, I could defend twice. Let's take, we'll take a little damage. It's okay, I'll just take two damage. Killing it faster might be good if it starts debuffing us. Slimed. I've been slimed. No. Uh, all right. Let's weaken it. Apply some damage. And it's just going to buff, so none of this matters, right? <laughs> Does any of this matter? Oh. Lick. Lim, lim, lim. 
I wonder what new spells we can get. Die. Die. 16 gold. Yeah! Sneaky strike! Uh, deal 12 damage. If you have discarded a card this turn, gain 2. That's my energy, right? Acrobatics. Draw 3 cards. This card 1. I've already got so many cards. Gain 5 blocks. Block is... Oh! The yeah, my block block is not removed at the start. Oh, so you could um you could stack a lot of block with blur. That's cool. Maybe we'll try more block this time. Uh, 12 damage is a pretty nice. I like sneaky strike though. Here I go again, taking damage cards over everything. If you have discarded a card this turn. So what do I have that discards cards? Just survivor right now. Still, 2 for 12 is not bad. Let's see if we get more discard later. Oh, is on screen chat being bad? No, it's fine. Right. Let's go. <laughs> so we still have this dude. Um, going to use a buff. Let's, I guess, just send it. What does Survivor do? Oh yeah, it doesn't really matter for this. Smashy smashy. Doesn't really matter that much. Because it's not going to hit me anyway. Ritual. Sneaky strike. Oh, it's going to hit me for six. Let's just... Sneaky strike it. And defend. <laughs> it's flailing its arms. It ended on the boss, Roy. The boss went to its second phase and absolutely annihilated me. Okay, cool. So let's use Survivor uh, to discard a strike. And then we can sneaky strike. And we get our energy back. And then we can slice and slice. Yay, sneaky strike came in handy gold out maneuver next turn gain five block draw two cards backflip <laughs> whoa uh this is nice for the discard dagger throw draw one card discard one card this has good synergy with our deck right now so i think let's go for that as much as i want to get some backflips going curl up um, on receiving damage, rolls up and gains five block once per combat. Okay. Um, we can weaken one of them. Maybe we weaken one and try to kill the other one. Though this one's going to gain seven block on re receiving damage. Hmm. Um, let's just see what we can do to this one here. Dagger throw does the most damage. I guess there's a chance I'll draw my strike, so we should do that one. I didn't draw it. Choose a card to discard. I'm not gonna defend. Oh, it doesn't really matter. I guess I could have defended twice and not taken any damage. Or I could kill it and take less damage from death. There we go. Uh, Sushi Cat, thank you so much for the two months. Yeah, let's do this. Get rid of a defend, and now a sneaky strike is free. Hiya! Can't quite kill it, but we got so much block, we won't take any damage. There we go. Oh, we got a poison potion. Apply six poison. Poison creatures lose HP at the start of their turn. So it's kind of like the opposite of regen. Um, prepare. Draw one, discard. Draw three, discard one. But right now, I'm like running out of energy. I have lots of cards. I like backflip though. But discard is good synergy. Discard is good synergy. Um, it's just a question of how. We only have three energy, so right now using energy to draw cards isn't very good. It might become better later, but right now, let's just take backflip. 
like backlog. Yes, first playthrough. This is our second run. Um, before you lies an elaborate shrine to a forgotten spirit. Transform a card, YOLO. <laughs> oh, okay, select a card to transform. Hmm, transform, transform is random, right? So why don't we transform one of our defense? Do I have any indication of what transform is going to do? Oh my god. Surely I'm not... <laughs> uh, I mean, YOLO. What? Add a random skill into your hand, it costs zero this turn. Okay, whatever. Mm. All right. You think the silent is your favorite super crazy build? That sounds fun. Okay, they're each gonna do 10. This is a little thievy thief. This one's easier to kill, so we probably start with the slime. Um, I kind of want to dagger throw the slime and see what we get. So let's start with that. We just got a strike. Um, our problem with backflip now is that even if I were to draw, I only have seven cards left. Oof, this is a little bit rough here. They're each doing 10 and I have no way of killing this one. I was hoping I'd be able to finish this one off, but it's not happening. Ouch, we're gonna take a lot of damage here. I can mitigate 10 of it, but what progress am I making then? I guess it depends what they do the next turn after that. Ouch. Um, how'd you enjoy Hollow Knight? I loved it. Yeah, this is confusing. If, if I knew what they were gonna do next turn, I would know how to play this a little better, but I don't know if it's worth mitigating damage, but then I'm just not making any progress killing them. Whereas if I hit it twice, I'm gonna take 20 damage, which feels kind of massive. Mm. Um, I'm just gonna work on killing it and I don't know, we'll see what happens. A little bit worried about how much damage those are dealing to me. This one's still gonna do 10. Distraction, all right. Well, let's uh, use Survivor and then Sneaky Strike for sure as ease. And then we can weaken the other one. Let's Sneaky Strike this one to finish it off. Oh, I guess I should have tried using this first. Oops, in case the skill is useful. Apply three poison to a random enemy three times. Okay. <laughs> there you go, get poison, motherfucker. Uh, three damage and apply weak, but it's still gonna... Oh, it's not gonna hurt me. All right, good. That's good, at least it won't hurt me. And it's just gonna die to its poison. I wonder how viable it would be to like play super defensive just with a lot of poison. That sounds pretty cool. It's just gonna block, so we may as well just deal DPS then. Yeah. Is there any point in drawing cards? Nah. Let's just strike it. Do as much damage as we can to it. Block doesn't help me, right? Whatever. It's gonna die to poison. Where's my spoke bomb? Let's see here. Hopefully we can just finish it off here. Yeah, dagger throw. Discard one of these, sneaky strike is free. But either way it's dead. Cool. Got my gold back. Essence of Steel, gain four plated armor. What's that? Oh, it'll probably just, it'll probably be like permanent four block would be my guess. Each turn, maybe. Or maybe each attack deals four less damage. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Each attack deals four less damage. That sounds really nice. All right, what are our new cards? Flying knee! <laughs> Ooh, poison stab. So much better stab. Um, choose a card. Next turn, add three copies of that card into your hand. Wow. But it does cost three. I 
I mean, doing something like a zero cast would be nice, but it's already a three cast itself, so like... Oh, sneaky strike! <laughs> you can have a whole bunch of free sneaky strikes. Hmm. Interesting card. Um, deal eight damage and then next turn gain an additional energy. That's nice. I only have three energy. It's poison? Poison defense sounds cool if we can make it happen. I don't know if we can make it happen. This one's rare though, right? That's what this means? So it feels like I should... Let me check that. Yeah. It's like, it makes me want to take it because it's rare, but I don't see it being good right now. Maybe it will be good if I get a really good card though. Cost three though. I just don't like it. I just don't like it for some reason. Um... Let's see how poison goes. I'm gonna start taking poison stuff and just kind of try that. Rest or smith? We do have a lot of health missing already. Oh, we don't regen health all the time on this one. Let's see like how much of an upgrade we would get for... Just, just like a reasonable increase. Doesn't increase the amount of energy. Grading is nice. But my health is so low. I don't know how else I'm gonna heal. I feel like I have to heal because I don't have a health regen on this character. Which kind of sucks. Alright, well, maybe we're about to get bodied on this beginning. I don't know. Let's see what we can do. It's sleeping. He's sleeping. Let's see what distraction does. Dodge and roll. Gain four block. Next turn, gain four block. <laughs> God damn it. Um. Yeah, tunic is so good. I don't know what I'm really gaining here. TBQH. Let's just do some damage to it. Oh, I woke it up. Yeah. Tempted to apply my six poison to it so that I don't die horribly. Let's do it. And it hits me for 18! Ah! I'm so dead already. Alright, well, we can poison stab you. We can block some of that. Not that much of it, though. Do we use our Essence of Steel already? Feels kind of sad using it already, but I also feel like I'm dying, so... Oh man, I don't know. I don't know, I feel like we're gonna lose an Act 1 this time. At least we got Dagger Throw. Get rid of one of these defends. Can use a free sneaky strike. Uh, probably survivor and strike. Get rid of our defend and then just strike with the other one. All right. Well. Ouchie, ouchies. Flying weak is nice, but of course it's when it's not gonna actually attack me. Uh, it's not gonna attack me, so let's just do what damage we can to it. Is there any point in using backflip? Can I get anything left in my deck that... No, I can't cast any of them anyway, but do I want them next turn or do I want to just get rid of them now? I think I use backflip simply because I don't want to draw those cards. I have better cards to draw. Yeah. Just trash them. Siphon Soul. Not bad. Okay, neutralize will help. Can I kill it though? I think I can kill it. It only has 18 HP. So let's just do as much damage to it as we can. Yeah, we can finish it off. 
Okay, it'll die to the poison, right? Thank frick. All right, it died to the poison. Whew. Toxic egg. <laughs> Whenever you add a skill into your deck, upgrade it. Ooh, so it's like we want to get more skills then. Cool. Tactician. If this is already Tactician Plus though, will it not be upgraded? Uh, unplayable. If this card is discarded from your hand, gain two energy. Oh, I like that a lot. Dagger Spray deals four damage to all enemies twice. Hmm. Doesn't help on huge bosses that much though. Um, deal five damage if the enemy has weak. Ooh. Oh, this is similar to that other one I had. Where, like, it was kind of okay, but then late game, five damage was nothing, so... I'm gonna use tech. I'm gonna get Tactician. It sounds fun. It's only gonna show you skills that are upgraded now. That makes sense. Alright. At least we don't have to heal this time. We can upgrade something. How come it doesn't let me discard a card? Where's it? Where'd I... Oh, I got the pipe to do that. That's right. Hmm... Um... All right, we can upgrade something. What would be good to upgrade? Ah, oh, it doesn't it doesn't change the draw discard one. Uh. <laughs> Come on, that doesn't do anything. <laughs> All right. Um maybe it'd be too good if it did. And this just increases the damage to upgrade it. Oh, it goes it costs zero. That's actually worth, I think. Cause right now it's it, this is nice. Yeah, but processing one is actually bad. I actually kinda like this. Sure, YOLO. Okay, cool. I'm in. Um well it's just a shop or a sh oh no, a chest or a chest. Oh yeah, chess! Rag of preparation at the start of each card. I'm drawing so many cards, holy crap! I have so much card draw. What can we do with that? I need that card that's like, for each card in your hand, do something. I'm like drawing my whole deck every turn. That could be cool though. That smells of combos to me when you're drawing that many cards. Gosh, my hand size is ridiculous. Um, gain two energy if we discard that. So this is kind of cool. Um, yeah, and I can backflip. So let's, uh, oh, it's not gonna, it's gonna use a buff. Let's not use that. Let's just strike it twice. Or wait, how do we want to do it? Let's strike it, and then let's dagger throw it, and then let's discard Tactician to go back to full energy. I think. Yeah. Strike it. Dagger throw it. And then we'll discard Tactician to go back to full energy. Ooh, I'm liking this! <laughs> That's fun! Um, probably just strike it a bunch. There's a, there could be some value in using backflip though if we get, since we've already discarded a card. Let's use backflip and see if we can snag our... Sneaky strike, let's go! Sneaky strike should be free this turn. Right? Yeah, there we go. Okay, we're getting some cool combos with this deck, I like it. And then probably just two strikes because it's just buffing. Okay. I like it, I like it, I like it. Cool, we have so much money by the way, holy crap. Does this character gain more money than the other ones? Enrage, whenever you play a skill, it gains two strength. Hmm. <laughs> well, this is gonna give it a bunch of strength if I do that. Um, then instead of using distraction, let's just neutralize it and then stab it a bunch, I think. Because then I'm not using any skills. And we're working on killing it. It's still going to deal 10 damage to me, but... I don't know. You hate this elite with the passion. Um, we can neutralize it again, which is nice. So let's make sure it's weakened. We're gonna take less damage, that's good. Probably use backflip this turn, see if we get anything else cool. Cause I don't have enough other stuff to really use. Oh God. 
I'm gonna like give it a bunch of strength if I keep using skills though. So as much as I want to use more skills, I feel like I should just strike it and try to just kill it next turn instead. As much as I would like to do more combos, let's just hope I can deal 13 damage to it next turn. Take our one damage. Yeah. Oh, now we're vulnerable. <laughs> okay, hopefully we can just kill it. Uh, it is a little poisoned. Darn it, we don't have a way to use Sneaky Strike well, though. Let's just poison it. Poison, stab it, and Sneaky Oh, it's gonna die. Thank goodness. Whew, get out of here! <laughs> All right, bronze scales. Start each combat with three thorns. When receiving attack damage, deals damage back. That's okay. Um, choose a card in your discard pile and return it to your hand. It causes zero this turn. I like that. That's a nice potion. All right. Skewer. Deal seven damage X time. So it just depends on how much energy I have. If I had like a, if I eventually build up a lot of energy, that could be good. But right now I'm a little bit suspicious of it. Acrobatics plus. Four cards. Hmm. I feel like I have to take it because it's plus. Oh yeah, because the skill, right, because every skill I find is always going to be plus. That's right, that's right. I've, I'm worried about getting too much card draw though and not enough like, because it still costs one. I'm worried about too much card draw and not enough actual stuff to use. It would be really nice to get more energy with all this card draw. Just seven damage, apply one week. One week is nice too. Helps me not die. I'm gonna take it. But I'm a little suspicious. Let's go the, um, uh, finding the other elite is a cool idea, but I like these question marks. Uh, we would get an extra bonfire if we go this way though. Maybe we go this way, heal up, fight an extra elite, heal up, and get the extra item from the elite though. I'm, these are interesting to me, but they might just be a shop. Oh, but I don't get a shop otherwise this route. What? I want to explore more of these question marks because I just don't know what they all can do. Oh, is a merchant. Yeah, we have so much gold. Thank goodness we got a merchant. Okay. John, tell you have seven cards in your hand. Oh my God. Give me, discard your hand and draw that many cards. Zero, two. Oh my gosh. We can fucking combo with this shit. Gain 10 block, deal 10 damage. I like that. Look at these metallic or these colorless cards. At the start of your turn, add a shiv to your... Shiv is just zero damage. Okay, it's infinite blades. <laughs> I wonder, uh, like it's just four extra damage a turn. I don't know, it's not bad, but... If the shivs could ramp somehow, that'd be cool. I'm looking for a card that will do something when I draw a card. That would be the best. Almost interested in another sneaky strike, to be honest. Okay, what can we get as far as this? I can buy this one. Oh, it's 10 max HP, but it costs so much. How about this one? Start each elite combat with two strength. I'm hoping that works on bosses. If it works on bosses, I'm interested. Dexterity improves block gain from cards. Not bad, but not amazing. Any really good potion? Escape from a non-boss combat. Uh, it doesn't seem very good. Gain three thorns. Draw three cards. God, so many cards. Um. Hmm. I like dash. We're, we're dealing damage. Ten block is a sizable amount of block. I like that. I like uh, sneaky strike as well quite a bit. Zero for nine block. Damn. Shuffle five random attacks into your draw pile. They cause zero this combat. Ooh. Wait, shuffle five random attacks into your draw pile. They cause zero this combat. So I use into your draw pile. I like metamorphosis mixed with all my card draw. Metamorphosis plus my card draw ability sounds great because I'm drawing so many cards. I'm gonna fucking go with that. It sounds fun. And then stuff like Calculated Gamble is nice too, but I do want another Sneaky Strike. Ah. 
Either expertise, maybe expertise and sneaky strike would be nice to get both of them. Then I'm getting some more card draw. And I do love, ah, oh, dash is so good though, but I can't get it. All right, whatever. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go. I'm going with, if I get another merchant, I'm gonna rage by the way. Okay, thank goodness. I don't know if they like tweak the RNG in this so it's not perfectly random. Like it'd be nice if you can't just get two merchants back to back. Oh, all right. Um, we meet again. A cheery, disheveled fellow approaches you gleefully. You do not know this man. It's me, Ronwid. Have any goods for me today? The usual? A fellow like me can't make it alone, you know? Ooh, I can get rid of my liquid memories. Choose a card in your discard pile and return it to your hand. It costs zero. I do love that, though. Or I can lose a sneaky strike. Locked requires at least 50 gold. Attack! Um, so do I want a relic in exchange for my liquid memories? Liquid memories is good, but a relic will be good the whole game. So let's get a relic. Um, what I've got for you today. I got a Tori. Whenever you would receive five, five or less unblocked damage, reduce it to one. Okay, so small chip damage is reduced to one. Okay. Unblocked damage. So uh, that also means I only need to block down to five and then that Tori will take care of the rest of it. It's interesting. Okay. Um, let's go. Yeah, so as long as I get, I have enough block to only take five, then it'll just take one instead. Metamorphosis! <laughs> oh man, why draw so many freaking cards, dude? It's kind of nutty. Um, all right, this one's gonna hit me for ten, and this one's going to buff. I, I just, I so want to just do this though. It is kind of unfortunate that it costs two because I only have three. Um. But maybe we just... Oh, but then we just use this and it'll only do one. It's fine. <laughs> okay, I don't know what this is gonna do. Oh my god, just a bunch of random cards. <laughs> All right, cool, 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 cool. And then if I had to like discard my whole hand and draw that and draw that many cards and draw seven cards or something, that'd be sick. Um... That makes it do seven, but I'm gonna, in order to, in order to do what I want, I'm gonna have to just probably play defend or a survivor, take no damage. Yeah. I mean, I could use backflip, but is there really any point? I guess they'll cost zero if I draw those, so maybe there is a point. Heck, maybe there's a point. Sure, let's backflip. Oh, I didn't get any of them. Dang it, I didn't get any of them. Okay, well. I only do one damage to me. But we're gonna draw a whole bunch of zero attacks now, which should be nice. Okay. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> deals eight damage twice, decrease the damage of this card. Wait, deals eight damage twice. Decrease the damage of this card by two, this comment. So it's not good to get it again. Oh man, I don't know if I how my draw was there, but let's see what we get with distraction. I just got a distraction. Okay, piercing whale. All enemies lose six strength this turn. Ooh, okay, so that'll that'll mitigate all my damage. So, okay, nice. Shackled. At the end of its turn, gain six. Okay. Hmm. Well, I didn't end up getting any discard, which is kind of sad. Does eight damage twice. So it's better to um, kill them both on the same turn, I think, if possible. So I don't, because when they die, they do this spork cloud thing and apply two vulnerable to me. So, I don't know how that'll factor in with this though, if it'll still just do one damage or what. Let's glass knife you. I'll get this one kill a ball. Yeah. All right, it'll be kill a ball. We still have a ton of free, free attacks sitting in our deck. 
Oh yeah, thorns. And the thorns still deal damage to it. That's nice. All right. Riddle with holes. Deal three damage five times. Skewer. What happens when you get skewer with... <laughs> but it's technically free. I guess it doesn't matter. Dante, you have seven cards in your hand. Draw four cards. Poison stab. Let's just finish this one off and then try to kill the other one. Hopefully we can. Yeah. The other one's going to do more damage. I think if I just, I think I can just kill it with Skewer. Let's see what Skewer does. I'm assuming it's going to do 777. It doesn't matter because it died. Okay, cool. I wonder if Carl gets sucked in. <laughs> I'm already getting sucked in. We got another one of those. I like those. And then, uh, ooh, deflect plus. Deal eight damage in the next turn, gain some energy. That's nice. I do love dagger throw, but mm, seven block for free is so nice. It's hard to say no to a plus. Sure. Try to get more block this game. Thievery. He draws so many cards. <laughs> uh, nice. We can play seven block. Can we discard a card? For our sneaky strikes? Yes, we can with dagger throw. All right. Let's use dagger throw. And then let's discard one of these defense. Uh, we can use our deflect for some nice defense. And well, it caused zero, so we may as well use this. Did it just give me a deflect? <laughs> so, whatever. All right. Mm, we've already discarded a card, so Sneaky Strike is free. And we can just start sending it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this deck is... I, I'm starting to enjoy this deck quite a bit. We have some cool turn ones. Good evening, Autistic Alchemist. Uh, I think the default behavior to not prescribe people who didn't ask. Oh, well, it's like I understand that people want um, some some people. I think it's different for different people because some people really want to know like little things about a game. Um, you know, like does this debuff work the way that I think it does or whatever. And a lot of people like it's nice knowing that for them. Um, I like that. I like that for like rules based questions. Like I like knowing the rules and the mechanics of the game. Um, but like when people are like, oh, this is the card you should do. You're so stupid. How did you not pick that card combination on your first time ever playing it? Like that's when it becomes aggressive backseating and is like, do something else with your life, please. <laughs> uh, don't worry, Neku. We'll get there eventually in one way or another. All right. Um, let's see how we want to do this. I think I just kill it. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> you can turn the number of cards. You can turn on the number of cards in hand. Okay. If I feel like I need that, I'll do that. I think I feel okay right now. Slice. Gain six block twice. I like that. See, that's so much better than the standard block. I think I'm drawing enough cards. Oh, but... <laughs> Let's try to play with more block this game. I didn't play with hardly any block last game. I feel like we should rest as much as I want to smith something just because we have a boss fight coming up and I don't really have any other way to heal. So let's just heal up. Yeah, Roy, I think some people just, there's not their default. So it's like, they just need to stop and think about it. Put yourself in someone else's shoes or at least respect their differences. Maybe they don't like the same thing as you. You can respect that. Um. All right, here we go. <laughs> Let's do it. Do we have a prediction? Let's do a prediction. Oh, we do have it. Okay, thank you. We already have it. All right, here we go. Going in. I do feel like I should spend more time thinning my deck, though, to some extent. God, I love how many things we get. And of course, we have to use Metamorphosis. Is this the same? Hold on, this isn't the same boss. Is it Hexagos? Have I already forgotten the boss? Uh, shovel five. Yeah, we definitely play metamorphosis, but wait, maybe first we play 
No, I don't have it. Never mind. Okay, metamorphosis. Nice, lots of nice abilities in there. All right, cool. Hmm, don't know what it's going to do. Not, oh, it says not attacking. Um, maybe it would have been smarter to play sneaky strike first. Oopsie doopsie cakes. That, I should have played sneaky strike first. No. Or can I still? Yeah, because it doesn't cost zero. I have to use it and then regain them. That was my bad. Uh, that was my bad. I didn't think about how to do that properly. Darn it. Yeah. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Whoops, we messed that up. Oh, here we go. Six, six. <laughs> oh my god. If I just use the Essence of Steel, that'll take care of that attack, though. Or maybe even neutralize. So if I neutralize it... It'll deal one damage six times because of my Tori, I hope. But nonetheless, I only have what I have in my hand, and I kind of have to use it all, so... We're gonna gain tons of block anyway. So let's not use the Steel thing yet. Maybe I don't need to use it. Not much to do other than just use all my cards. Okay. I'm pretty sure it won't do very much damage to me. Yeah, it just deals one. Alright. Uh, it's only gonna do six damage. Let's start out with our distraction. And we get a deflect. Gosh darn it. <laughs> um. What is an eight? Start each combat with this card in your hand. Oh, you do a bunch of backstabbing. What did I get backstabbed from? Oh, that was my random card thing. Okay, cool. Um, well, let's use Survivor so that we can get a free sneaky strike. And then let's use that. Well, it didn't really matter actually. Okay. We have plenty of block anyway. All right, cool, it won't hurt us. 18 block, what is this character? <laughs> That's nice. Finisher, deal six damage for each attack played this turn. Ooh, well, we do what we can, I guess. Um, nice. Well, yeah, let's use, let's get rid of that. I mean, it'll at least count as another attack for our finisher. Okay, three attacks played. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> and we'll get some block. All right, this character's fun. I like this character. I think the second attack will deal one because of our Tori. Yeah, that's so nice. We're not taking hardly any damage. Ooh, maybe I just skewer. It's gonna do six. Tactician plus. Do I have a discard right now? No, sadly nothing for that. All right. What's better? Just use skewer? I mean, poison stab is probably worth it. Maybe poison stab and then deflect and skewer. Okay. Get some poison going. Get some block going. And then we skewer it with the rest. All right. This is your favorite character. Burn. Ooh, we got a burn card. Don't like that. Um, ooh, we got some good stuff though. 10 block. Oh, but it's not gonna attack. Dang it. I always get the block when it's not gonna attack. Well, nonetheless, we're doing a lot of damage to it, so that's good. Don't need all this block. I don't need all this block! <laughs> Alright, it's buffing itself. Oh, two sneaky strikes and no way to discard. You hate to see it. Well, let's use dodge and roll. Get some block cooking. And it's not really any difference. So, darn. Bad draws there. Just blocks it all. 
Let's see how my block goes with these attacks. I'm hoping I only take one from its other attack. Oh, one and seven. Darn it. That didn't work so well that turn. Uh, I'm probably weak to it. That's good. We have infinite block. So. Well, we're not taking damage. This is another... This is an interesting... Oh, I don't like how we're getting these burns. We're going to start drawing burns. I don't like that at all. Uh, draw until you have seven cards in your hand. Maybe we just backflip. Let's just backflip. Hmm. Probably dagger throw? Can I discard the burn? Yeah. Oh, that's kind of nice to discard the burns. Then it doesn't actually burn me. Um, unfortunately, I'm not quite sure what I should be doing. What's in my deck exactly? I've got, I don't have a whole lot of zeros. I can draw. I mean, I can draw dash and deflect and sneaky strike, actually, and neutralize. So maybe I, maybe it is worth playing something like acrobatics. It's kind of hard to say, though. Gonna do a lot of damage to me too. But if I don't draw one, then it does nothing. Four times six. Yikes, by the way. I'm probably gonna use the essence of steel. Or else I think I'm gonna get fucked. Maybe I didn't need to because it only had 27 HP, but I was worried about taking a lot of damage right there at the end. Oh, it's burning me so hard. Like, I feel like I need—I just need to finish it off. Yeah, let me just finish it off. Maybe a waste of the thing. Probably a waste of the thing. I did, I think I forgot to realize how low its health was. So I think I wasted that um, shield thing, but oh well. We got it. Yeah, but it wouldn't have been 111 if I hadn't used that. <laughs> Chat, when it says six times four, does that mean six damage four times? Or does that mean six hits four damage? Which one is which? Because I got a little confused though. Is if, Which one is the damage and which one is the number of attacks? Four damage six times. Oh, damn it, it would have done anything. Oh, see, I, I in my head I had it backwards. In my head I had it backwards. It was four damage. Yeah, first number is damage. Okay, okay, okay. Darn it. Um, yeah, so I, I wasted that. Oh, well. Um, whenever you play a card, deal one damage to all enemies. A thousand cuts. <laughs> That's interesting. Um, next turn, your attacks. Next turn, your attacks deal double damage. Well, that's pretty nice. This turn, your next two skills are played twice. That's interesting, too. What do we have in the way of skills? Skills are played twice. It's like my block stuff. I had a random skill to your hand. <laughs> you, you, it's a trade reaction. You get you use distraction with extra skills, and it gives you it gives you another distraction, and it just chain reacts into like infinite cards. Let's go. You play every skill in the game. <laughs> uh, I'm not making use of cards like acrobatics because at the end of the day, I usually have enough cards. If I start out playing it though, my hope was like drawing sneaky strikes with it, and then I can play free sneaky strikes. I feel like I need to cut some cards from my deck soon. It'll probably help me out here. All right, um, dealing double damage next turn for zero sounds nice. So let's get that one. Right. Oh yeah, we get a chest. Nice. Attacks that cause zero deal four additional damage. That's what I needed for the anger deck, by the way. <laughs> hmm. During boss and elite combats, gain an extra energy. That's nice. Um, gain one additional energy all the time, but all enemies start with combat with one strength. Hmm. 
I don't really have that many zero attacks, but when I use this, they become zero. Uh, yeah, Sneaky Strike still won't be a zero attack even, but Metamorphosis is like the only thing I have that are zero attacks. So that feel, Metamorphosis attacks will deal four additional damage. Um, versus just having, I think just bosses and elites having this all the time with no debuff is nice. Whereas it's just one strength though. <laughs> That's just one additional damage, right? <laughs> I think we go with the Slaver's Collar. It'll help us on boss fights and elites. And that's what we need help on the most. So let's just go with that. Uh, Desiring Egg is a meme that is like a YouTube video meme, or maybe it was like a Vine or something. I don't know, back in the day. Um, let's see. Question of if I want a shop yet or not. Shop could be good to start purging my deck. Which sounds like it might be a nice idea to start purging my deck, to be honest. Let's start getting rid of cards. Ooh, artifact. Negates three debuffs. And block is not removed at the start of its turn. Yeah, so I have to get through the 20. Next turn, your attacks deal double damage. <laughs> cool. All right, let's start out with Distraction Plus. Piercing Whale. All enemies lose six strength this turn. Well, you hate to see it. Um, it doesn't do anything. It gets rid of one of those. Uh, next turn, your attacks deal double damage. Is there any point in playing Acrobatic? I feel like I should. I should get some. I should get some. My hand is full. Is it gonna keep drawing? Uh oh. Oh, I didn't know it was a full hand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I didn't know that you could do that. Darn it. I wanted to. Um. I wanted to draw. Man. Well, it'll, it'll do double damage next turn anyway. Oh, why didn't I discard this? <laughs> Wait, can I still discard? I'm being stupid! Oh my god, there's so many cards! Uh, Alright, well, definitely gonna do that for next turn. May as well do this for some free damage. Hmm. Is there any point in me even gaining two energy? Well, I'm practicing, alright? There we go. That would have given me two energy back if I were smart. It doesn't give me block later, so that's good. Let's use that one. It's fun going through so many cards in one turn. I bet I can do some cool stuff once I get a little better at the game. Holy crap, it has so much block. Okay, it'll only hit me for one right now. Because of my Tori. Now we do double damage. Is it just this turn? Yeah, just this turn is double damage. Okay, well in that case, I think we should use our dagger throw and see what we draw. Because we definitely want to prioritize doing damage right now. Chante has seven cards in your hand. Oh my god. Sadly. Oh, sadly, I don't know how to use this well right now. Chante has seven cards in your hand. This is what I'll draw. See, the thing is, is I'm going to get sneaky strikes and I can't use them. I needed it first. It'd be so, it'd be so sick to do double damage sneaky strikes right now. Aw, chat being wholesome. Thank you, Kit. All right. Darn it. I need like one more energy. Oh, hey, it's imagine if I had taken the thing to get one more energy all the time. <laughs> Fun. Oh my God, dude. The nice thing about this is that they're all gonna go like into my next few cards, but I can't say no to this 24 damage right now. So let's just do it. <laughs> Uh, the regular enemies, I guess, are a little bit more annoying than I gave them credit for. So this is... Oh, attack for 10 damage two times. I should have just hovered over it. All right. Do I have a discard here? Of course not. Attack for 10 damage two times. Hmm. Let's see what we can get. Cause... Oh, I don't have any zero cost. Man, can I kill it? 
just not going to be able to kill it. The three damage will hit it next turn, though, right? So that'll be nine damage. No, it's just not enough. Shoot. I'm going to use that. I wish I could discard a card with this cards, but I just can't do it. Gaining additional block isn't going to matter right now. Because the first attack is going to get Tori down to 1, and then the next one's going to do 10. So doing any additional block isn't going to help me right now, sadly. Unless I draw something. Wait, there's only one card left in my deck. I'm going to draw a fucking Sneaky Strike, dude. Ah, oh, The Sneaky Strikes, I feel like I have the cards to make them work, and they keep not working out for me. Yeah. Let's do our best to weaken it. And we'll take some damage, but it's okay. Hi, Kara! Rubbing your face with your old choices, right? We're down to one HP, man. All right, just finish it off. Die. Eleven gold. All enemies lose eight strength. All enemies lose eight strength this time. Hmm. That's nice, but zero for seven block is so nice when I start drawing 8,000 cards. More zero costs are really nice. Okay, I think I'm gonna delete a card from my deck. Let's see though. <laughs> the effects of your X cards are increased by two. Oh my gosh, that uh, combination with that like seven damage. I guess it's, I guess it's not that much though. Oh, this one's so nice, as in to steal. It's hard not to want to buy that. Hmm. Leg sweep. Apply three weak. Gain 14 block. Oh my gosh. The bomb. <laughs> At the end of three turns, deals 50 damage to all enemies. I mean, reduce the cost of all cards in your hand to one this combat. I kind of want to buy that because that allows Sneaky Strike to actively give me additional energy. Holy shit. Sneaky, Sneaky Strike's given me energy with that. That could be sick. Like, big turn, turn one. Like, turn one, just annihilate with that. I kind of want to do it. Maybe that and then card removal service. Uh, I have just enough money for that. Cost one less for each card discarded this turn. Eviscerate could also be good. It could be a zero cost with enough of my discards. This just sounds fun, though. <laughs> Let's try it. Oh, I can't do math. Shit. Oh, I'll get this one. I was looking at this one, and then I looked at that one, and I got them re reversed in my head. Uh, Assassin's of Steel looks is going to be really helpful for us, I think. All right, let's go. Yes! <laughs> if only... Oh, do I not have any of my draw cards? No. 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 Yes, I do! All right. I mean, nothing else to do. Come on, draw something that actually is useful. Yes, okay. What will discard? Do I have a discard or have I already used a discard? I haven't. Yeah, here we go. I can do acrobatics. There we go. No, I thought this shit again. My hand is full. Whoops. Hmm. Oh, this shit again. No, it won't let me do it? Wait. Oh, it's just the current ones. It's not, I thought it's in, these cards are in my hand right now. I thought they'd be infected by enlightenment. I didn't know, there's no way I would know that it doesn't do that. I just needed to play this later. It made sense, if these are in my hand, it makes sense they should be reduced to one. Oh, that's how I would have thought it would work. Man, that sucks. I have to wait to play it, all right, fine. Um, well, at least it's never hurting us. Um, that sucks. Dude, and I have Tactician too, and I can't even discard it. Oh, all right, this character is really fun, but you got to make sure you get the rules down first. And I did not have the rules down. It might have been that way if it was a power. Yeah, I kind of confused skills and powers. All right. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. 
Let's start with this. Start with this. See what we get. Leg sweep. Ooh, two weak, 11 block. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because it's going to do that, but... All right, whatever. At least the two weak will be there for later. Um... Sure, I'll use... Can I just kill it? No, let's use Metamorphosis. It's fun. <laughs> Metamorphosis is fun. And we'll do a little double damage next turn. And hey, there's a chance we draw one of them now. Nope. But that's good. We can get rid of them for later. Yeah, powers seem to affect your character underneath here, whereas skills only apply to the cards currently in your hand, I guess is how I see it now. Anyway, everything deals double damage now. We should just be able to absolutely annihilate this thing. Backstab. Boom. Dagger throw. Boom. Get that one. Strike. Strike. And dodge. Damn, that double damage card is sick. All right. And I have enough blocks so that it won't do much to me. It died to my thorns. <laughs> nice. Infinite blades. At the start of your turn, add a shiv. Start of your turn, add a shiv. I'm trying to see if I can think of which cards I want to keep and which ones I want to get rid of. Apply seven poison. That sounds great. I also really like this. Prepared plus, draw two, discard two. I think I'm gonna get this one because I think it's gonna really help me as much as I want this deadly poison. I think this is gonna really help me make sure that my I'm always actually getting free, free blades. <laughs> sure, let's go this way. Fight another elite. Yeah, for zero, right? Well, sneaking past a group of shrouded figures, one of them approaches you. Got anything for me, friend? Please, maybe some coin? I just need somewhere to stay. I have treasures I can trade. <laughs> he seems delusional but harmless. Obtain a relic. Oh my god, dude. Become cursed. At the end of your t So if I discard a curse... Are we cool? Can I Because it's a card, right? So if I just discard it with all my discard stuff, maybe we're good. At the end of your turn, game of frail. It's just a card that goes in my deck, right? Hmm. Too bad I don't have the gold. I'm gonna try it. You snatch the precious relish from his clutches. Wait, I just stole it? What? I don't think I paid attention to what I was doing. Whenever you use a potion, heal five HP. I like that. Okay. Uh, well, apparently I'm evil. Whoops. I mean, it fits the character somewhat, I guess. Okay, now this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Two sneaky strikes. And it prepared. One, now, is it gonna work right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Chat, is it going to draw two and discard two or is it gonna say get fucked, you can't draw cards? Let's just use deflect first. Well, I wanna know the answer to that. I'm gonna use, I'm just gonna use deflect to Avoid learning that. <laughs> draw. Will it draw one, discard two? Yeah, let's use deflect first. And then let's use prepared. It sh it'll still draw two. Okay, cool. Good. Choose two cards to discard. Probably just these strikes, right? Oh, double damage next turn. I love that one. Until you have seven cards in your hand. Uh... Well, actually, maybe we keep the strikes because the sneaky strikes are free. Uh, I would like more block, though. So, play dodge and roll, maybe. Do I want to keep expertise? Not for one, I think. I'll just get rid of it. I, I'm not. I'm not using that card very well. All right. Definitely double that. Um, we can strike you twice. No, I didn't. 
My brain does not do sneaky strike right ever. They need a fucking undo button. Holy shit. No. Oh, man. No, dude. In my brain, it's not what happens in the actual card. I need to play it first, and then I get the two energy. God, I keep thinking I'm gonna pl I'm gonna gain two energy from playing it, so I'm using my energy first. It's not how it works. It's not how it works. Oh my god, dude. All right, well, learning. Damn. I need to actually play it instead of being stupid. Oh. Cost of all cards currently in your hand. Oh man, that doesn't matter much. Matters a little bit. Dang it. We bungled that. All right. Well, it's my first day playing the game. We didn't make very good use of the double damage either. Delay damage, draw a card. Maybe we can kill it this turn. Uh... See, in this case, it's going to give me energy. This is where I was getting confused. Right? If I've discarded a card this turn, which I will once I do that, or if I play this. So if I play acrobatics, it's going to literally give me positive energy. Shame. Discard that. Sure, let's play that. Nightmare. Choose a card next. Had three copies of that card next turn. Well, I think I can kill it this turn. Let's see. It's got three shield. Um. Does eight damage twice. I think I'll just kill it. So let's dagger throw it. Let's make sure I've got this right. Sneaky Strike should refill my energy. Yeah, see, that's where I was getting confused was from that right there. But it's a different card interaction. I just got to pay attention to which one's happening at each time. Okay. Um, is it going to die? Oh, because of the malleable, it's taking less damage. That's right. Okay. Unfortunately. But that's okay. We'll get three glass knives next turn. Wait, will I not be able to use it this turn, though? Can I cancel this? Oh, God. What does this mean? What? Uh, I hope it's not can't. I hope it's not getting rid of that card. Okay, it's not. Thank fuck. Um, yeah, we can't quite finish it this turn, but that's okay. Feebling spores. Ouch. But we should hopefully just be able to kill it with three glass knives that cause zero. <laughs> uh, dagger spray. So three damage to all enemies. Twice. All right. Cool. <laughs> Got a skill potion. Nice. Um, crippling cloud. Oh my goodness. Wait. A plot. What? 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 <laughs> Is this a glitch? <laughs> oh, I don't understand this card. It's, I'm assuming uh, targeting one enemy and then just making them vulnerable forever. I mean, this is nice too. Seven poison and two weak to all enemies. That's also nice. But I don't currently have anything giving me vulnerable, and this is zero? So, like, fuck, man. This is good, too. I wish I'd been using more flying knees, honestly, to ramp a little harder. Um, I mean, on a boss or something, this is going to be super useful. 50% extra damage is huge, so let's take it. All right. Uh, we can either heal up or die to a boss. <laughs> uh, fuck me. Um, YOLO. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> All right, come on. Give me a good hand. I'm full of shame. No. Please have a discard in my hand. Please have a discard. Oh, my God. All right, we have to backflip and hope for a discard. Dude. Oh. 
Come on, give me one of my discards. Okay, thank fuck. Thank fuck. All right, so we can discard Tactician and gain two energy. That's good. This is good. This is doing better now. Doing better now. All right. Um, but also we could discard Shame. What's better? Probably just want to use all of our strikes. Okay. Gain a block. And we're going to discard Tech. What does Frail do exactly? Hmm. Guess I'm about to find out. <laughs> uh, we got tons of block. Sneaky Strike refunds itself this time. So we're just going to work on killing these guys. Minions abandon combat without their leader. So I could just kill this guy. Um, but they're going to do so much damage to me. Well, they're not going to do any damage to me this turn, though. But next turn, though, I'm not too sure if I'm... Like, this guy is 142. I don't think I'm going to kill him anytime soon. So maybe killing the minions is the way to go. This one-shots it. Maybe I can strike this guy three times. And then poison the big guy. All right. Well... What does Frail do exactly? Gain 25% less block for one turn. Yeah, that's fine. Oh. I think I made him buff himself, though. But that's okay. Drop our cards, discard one, and then we can use Sneaky Strike. Yeah. I could use uh, Expertise, too, to simply draw one. Well, I need to discard, though. Discard is good. Dagger throw, though. Draw four, discard one. Oh, probably discard expertise. Okay, now I can use Sneaky Strike for free, so I'm gonna do that probably. Double damage next turn. Yeah, I didn't get. Let's see. I was hoping to get this one. I might draw it, so I might. Um... I might play Dagger Throw first for the hopes of drawing that. Let's play Dagger Throw first. I still have enough to cast Sneaky Strike. Oh, cool! Um, She's a card to discard. Well, this lets me Sneaky Strike to gain some stuff back. So I can Sneaky Strike, gain some energy back. Deal double damage next turn. It doesn't really matter. We'll just play everything. All right. All right. Whatever. Yo, Thab. Hello. I hope you're enjoying Rebirth, Thab. I'm so excited to play it. I just started um, the intermission, and I like how it's just like, uh, I like how the Final Fantasy VII intermission thing is just like, hey, let's play Fort Condor with all of the people who died. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what it's gonna do. It says not attacking. So. Rally. Oh, it's gonna summon new nerds, isn't it? Ooh, that's the downside of killing them. Okay. Well, I do double damage this turn. Um. I can apply vulnerable to him. Oof. Let's draw two, discard two before we decide what to do next, I think. Yeah. See if we get something better. Oh, probably just get rid of my two defense. Yeah. Darn. Add a random skill into your hand. Well, let's do that first. I mean, come on! Alright, fine. Next turn will be good too, I guess. Um. The question is, am I going to need to use that? to? Because they're going to take a lot of damage here. I have 11 block. 9 times 3 is scary, though. This thing will take it all down to one, so I might have to do that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do that. Because I didn't get enough attack cards. I think I have to use the player skill. Because it's nine damage three times. Yeah, I'll take it down to one. Um, all right, this thing has like 90 million honorable, but. Ooh, I got weakened by it. What? Why didn't they take it all down to one? 
Hello? What didn't I? Oh, I didn't understand something. What happened? At the end of your turn, gain one block. Oh, it doesn't do what I thought it does. What? I thought the thing would reduce all damage by four, but it didn't do that. I understand that it's nine damage three times. I thought I used an item that reduced all damage by four. This combat, that's clearly not what it does. Plated armor is what I, is what it did, right? At the end of your turn, gain one block. Receiving, receiving unblocked damage reduces plated armor. Yeah, plated armor doesn't do what I thought it did. I misunderstood what plated armor was, unfortunately. Darn it. I didn't do it right. Oh man, we're getting owned. I didn't get any, oh, we're getting owned, no. Oh, I didn't read it right. I mean, I didn't have anything to do anyway though. Shoot. I don't know, I feel like I'm dead here. Feels like I'm dead here. I can kill this guy. And hope. It doesn't nothing doesn't matter. I guess I can cast. No, I don't think it changes anything. I can kill this guy and hope that things work out. Cause it'll die before it hits me. Next turn we'll start drawing some good stuff. But oh man. Damn, man. Okay, five block, draw two cards. There's hope there. What's this one? Next turn, double damage. Shame! <laughs> oh, man. Can discard the shame, at least. Do I sneaky strike this guy just to get rid of him? Probably. It's not even gonna kill it though. No, I have enough block. I have enough block. Let's just, we need to just deal with this guy. Two damage, one weak. It doesn't matter, because I'm not gonna take damage this turn anyway, because of my block, so. All right, we need to just finish this guy off. Rally. Oh, they keep multiplying though, so maybe it was good that I was killing them. Alright, I need to finish this guy off. I have double damage right now. Yeah. We just need to finish this guy off. That's what we need to do. Oh my god, Ruby just sat on <laughs> Ruby. She just sat on my headphone cord. Oh. Uh okay, let's play this and hope we get some damage cards. Yay! We need to just finish it this turn. Oh, cool. Nice. We'll finish him. All right, thank goodness. We survived, but barely. Whew. All right, what do we get? At the start of boss combat, steal 25 HP. I like that. Dex potion. Next turn, gain three energy. Deal six, ooh, deal six damage to all enemies twice. Eh, not that good though. More of this. Um, the thing is, is that I'm likely to gain this on the first turn and then I don't need it as much on the second. Though actually, if I have that, this is good with my, um, this is good with my draw four cards and my draw up to seven cards, actually. I'll try it. I'm probably gonna draw it at the end when I don't need it, but I'll try it. Then pulling it off. Whew. All right, this is our only option. So let's go here. Yeah, I misread what that what one of those items did for me. All right, we're gonna take twelve, but we should be able to defend that. Inner seven block. Not 
100% sure how I want to do this. If I want to play outmaneuver. Metamorphosis is weird. It ended up being kind of weird. I'm not sure if I should play dagger throw and see what I get, or if I should just play outmaneuver and metamorphosis. It's only going to hit me for one. And you'd receive five or less. So it's only going to hit me for one right now, which is good. So I don't need to worry about blocking anymore. Let's see how this goes. I'm hoping I'll get some card draw because I didn't have any card draw that turn. Discard. We deal 14 damage. Discard all non-attack cards in your hand. Interesting. We'll do that last. Um, let's do start with backflip. And hopefully we draw more card draw. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> no! I didn't get any of it. We have so much block. Expertise. Draw until you have six cards in your hand. Wait, this is good. This is good. This is good. Holy shit. This is good. Um, let's do that last. So let's gain a bunch of... Gain a bunch of block. And then I don't need any more block this turn, but I do want to just get, yeah. Oh, but this will unload will get rid of expertise, which is sad. Yeah, that's kind of sad. Um, all right, well, we have to just do it like this. We'll at least draw three cards with this. No, no, no. Oh my God. Well, we can unload at least. Get rid of the mystic first. Plus 14 damage, discard all not attack cards. Well, the good news is it discards the curse, so. Alright, whatever. Could have been worse. I was hoping to have gotten that one last turn. Slice. Mm, end that one. <laughs> Shit. Uh, let's apply weak to you. Use that one last. Or maybe I... Hmm. Guy's got 12 shield on. Let's start going through this shield. Uh, what's the best way to do this? I want to get seven cards first because I want to be able to cast any of my two casting costs, guys. So I think I play this one. Draws five cards. That's good. Let's play it now. Draw five cards. I did get a sneaky strike. Discard one card at random. <laughs> All right, we'll play that one last. Nice, we can apply vulnerable, that's good. We can do sne these sneaky strikes for free. Mm, I don't need to apply any more block. This is fun, I like how this is going. Um, let's exhaust this nerd and then finish him off. I've surely discarded a card this turn, right? I'm gonna play this just in case because I can't remember if I have. Is there a way to check if I've discarded a card this turn? Or is there a way to know whether this will refund or not? If I... Doesn't really tell me. Uh, card glows gold if its condition is met. Thank you. Let's play prepared then. Just two cards to discard. Um, I don't need any more block this turn, so let's get rid of this. And I don't think I need any more card draw this turn, so let's get rid of that. Maybe, though. I get rid of poison stab instead and I draw there's four cards this is what I'm gonna draw yeah wait I could draw flechettes deal four damage for each skill in your hand oh maybe I should wait on that then yeah 
Oh, Ruby. Oh, sorry, Ruby. There you go. There's only four cards left in my deck, so I would draw all of those. I would be able to cast this one and this one. Maybe this will do a lot of damage though if I draw it right now. Wait, I can't draw it right now though. Oh, choose card to discard, right. Uh, the problem is is that I have to use Sneaky Strike. No, that's okay. I'll use two Sneaky Strikes. How many more skills do I have? I don't have any other skills. Yeah, I would use my only skill. Okay, I'm gonna do it this way. So I'm gonna use my sneaky strikes first. Wait, did it turn gold? Oh, the carded border right now is gold. Oh, okay. All right. Use my sneaky strikes. One HP. But that's okay. We'll do that eventually. Let's use acrobatics. Um, and what don't we need? We don't need enlightenment, so let's get rid of enlightenment. Now, we'll play discard one card at random. Will it still let me play this if I can't discard a card? Like if it's the last card in my hand? I hope it'll still let me play it. The goal is to... Uh, may as well use this. Oh. Did I just use a skill? Shit! Should have used that one first. Um. Oh damn it! The zero. All right, but that'll finish that guy off, and that's the important part. So I have six block. It'll deal ten damage, but then that damage will be reduced to one by my Tori. All right. I have double damage now. We should be fine anyway. Oh, it's gonna do 8-3. Smashy, smashy. Oh shit, I can't kill it, but that's okay. Because with weekend and all of my block, we should be okay. Even though it's reduced. Uh... Oh, that's sad. I'm gonna get hit for a six, aren't I? Or is it going to take three damage each time it hits me? Yeah, it died before the last hit hit me. Let's go. That was good. Um, attack potion. Sure. Deadly poison. Mm, 14 block. Coming handy, but two is a lot. I do like poison. I'm leaning towards this one. Seven poison just seems nice to get cooking early on in a fight. 14 block could save my ass though. Three weak and 14 block. I could save my ass. Yeah, I know Bonopi. This, the, this character seems great at avoiding damage. I like that. Um. Yeah, let's go with this one. Question mark time, I think. Yeah, let's get to this fire. We need to live. Just need to live. Delectable tea or deadly poison. <laughs> uh, you walk by an eerie statue holding several masks. Something behind you softly whispers, stop. You swerve around to face the statue, which is now facing you. Uh, on closer inspection, it's not a statue, but a statuesque gaunt man. Is he even breathing? Face, let me touch. Maybe trade. 50% good face, 50% bad face. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> oh, look, this run is already cursed. We gotta take some risks now. Oh shit, seven HP for seventy-five gold is nice. My HP's already low. Yolo. Uh, your face has been swapped. Start each combat with one week. 
No! We got a bad phase. All right, well, it was a nice run, chat. It was a nice run. Oh, if I just come out with one strength. Dag nab it. We'll rest here. I still think that was the right play because we weren't winning otherwise, I think. Uh, let's go this way and see if... Oh, it's just... A... All right. <laughs> oh. We do 25% less damage on our first turn, and our first turn's our best turn. No. Hmm. Um, do we have a discard right now? Get some deflect going. Shame. Let's draw two cards and just see if we can get something that'll discard for Sneaky Strike. Well, we can use Distraction. Adrenaline! Oh, okay. Draw two cards and gain a thing. I like that. Dude, give me something to discard! Oh my god, apparently I need more discard. I feel like I have too much discard and I still need more. Just can't fucking draw it, dude. You hate to see it. Sucks, man. I drew so many cards and just didn't... I think my deck's getting too big. I don't know. Well, we can fucking poison one of them and then just be shame and live in shame. It sucks. And deadly poison you. Shame. You hate to see it. What horrible draws, though. Yay, they're all buffing. Yeah, we have too many cards in our deck. I think that might be the issue. Hey, there it is. <laughs> oh, man. Six each, which is just above the amount for our Tori. Uh, I think we're going to have to do... Oh, deal 10 damage. Draw one, discard one. Well, let's get Phantasmal Killer cooking. Um, I'm gonna play Acrobatics and see what happens. Let's just see what we draw here. Don't have enough energy for this many strikes anyway, so let's just get rid of that. Yeah. Lightning ended up not being very good for this deck, I don't think. I don't think this card should be in the deck. I think I messed that one up. Um, well, let's play Vulnerable and see what we can do to it. Oh, prepared. All right. Um, we have one energy left. You hate to see it, dude. <laughs> oh, man. We can at least weaken this one. Maybe it'll die to the poison, actually. Yeah, maybe it'll just die to the poison. We're going to take a lot of damage, though, which isn't great. Nah. Sadness. 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 Just kill that one. Save. I don't think there's any going back. <laughs> Alright, well, we deal double damage this turn, so we get all the stuff that will affect us next turn. Perfect. <laughs> oh, cards like Metamorphosis, like, I like, but, and Outmaneuver, but I don't think I, my deck is too big and, like, too random to really make use of them, I feel. So I don't think I'm, like, getting anything out of it, really. As much as I like them. Um, like, this was a perfect example of how this deck has, like, anti-synergy with itself. My first turn, I got all of... I drew, like, ten cards, but didn't draw the stuff that had synergy with discard. And then for two turns after that, I drew all the prep stuff that I would have loved to have used on turn one. So it was just, like... I, I would have to like thin my deck more and focus. I think what I'll do next time is focus on thinning my deck more and like focusing on small ideas. But we just like spread ourselves too thin this game. 
So we're getting all the stuff when we don't need it, and... And then the other stuff that we needed to go with that on the other turns that we already don't have any chance to do anything anymore. Alright, um... interest of staying alive I think I'm gonna just use block and outmaneuver and hope for a better future they're slowly getting stronger oh great we drew immediately drew outmaneuver again and metamorphosis again <laughs> come on game Oh, man. Oh. My goodness. Um... Man. <laughs> Can't even kill one of them. And they're just getting stronger and stronger. I need to just take care of them. All right, let's use an attack potion. Oh. oh, this would be this twice. Now this one's the way to go. Uh, still can't finish it off, I don't think, though. Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. 11 blocks still means I'm taking 12 damage, which blows. Hey, stuff. Costs one additional for each time you lose. Oh, <laughs> it's better to get early. Interesting. Sneaky strike. Well, let's use this. Ooh, 10 block, 11 damage. That's a good one still. Uh, do I have enough energy for everything? I think I do, so I may as well just get rid of our weakest attack. Maybe just strike. Oh no, this is... Yeah, it's one of those. All right, um... Let's finish this one off. And then... Uh, can't quite finish that one off. Yeah, Sage. That makes sense. Oh. Deadly poison. More deadly poison. <laughs> At this point, I'm like, fuck it, I'll just add more cards. Well, we're still hanging on. We're still hanging on. Let's see if we can at least get to the boss. Oh yeah, this thing. When you hit it multiple times, it's kind of bad, right? Because it gains three block, but then it goes up to more block. Mm, all right, next turn we do double damage. This card ended up not really being good. I forget what I had in mind for this. Oh, I had in mind for gaining energy with the, that's what I had in mind with this. Gaining energy with the cards that I never draw with it. <laughs> Well, I've only got two energy left, so I'll get rid of one of these strikes. Can't use them all anyway. Flying weak is good. And then we'll apply some poison. And now do we block? It's doing five damage three times, so it'll just do one damage for everything, so we're good. We are good already. Let's just do more damage to it. Snake plant. Oh, it didn't even do damage to it because of the, because <laughs> the other thing. Neck plant. 
Well, we do double damage this turn, so let's see if we can make some use of this. Draw four cards, discard one with Tactician. There we go! These are the combos that I wanted! Um... Let's use Survivor and discard Defend. And then let's use Acrobatics, draw four cards, and then I'll gain our two energy back with Tactician. There we go. It's working! <laughs> it's happening! Now we can Sneaky Strike for 26 for free, which is pretty smexy. Um, can we finish it off? I don't know if, po if Deadly Poison will be doubled by double damage. I don't think so. I don't think it will. So then it's a question of do we want to just Deadly Poison and do a bunch of defense? Five block, that'll take me to 13, and then six more will take me to 19. That'll ensure we only take one damage. Yeah, let's just do that. Deadly poison. Defend. Hmm. And it's gonna take three damage each time it hits me with that. There we go. Alright, this is going okay. So there's still some hope here. If things go well, it all kind of works out. Every time we use a potion, we gain three life, by the way, which could, or we gain five life, which could come in clutch. At the start of your turn, apply two poison to all enemies. I'm assuming that stacks, and so it'll apply two poison every single turn. I like that. At the start of your turn, apply two poison to all enemies. So every turn, we're stacking poisons. Hmm. Poison deck would be cool. Maybe I'll try that next time. Sure. Assuming it keeps stacking every turn, that's nice. I hope it does. Wow. Maybe we're gonna combo here. Oh, I don't have a discard, do I? Dang it, no discard. Yeah. Darn it. Mm, Alright, well next turn double damage. Let's get some block. Sad. Oh! Maybe I'll draw it. Hold on, there's still hope. Draw a discard, maybe? Damn it, no. Alas. Um. May as well poison. Oh, there's like a big dude and then this buffy dude. Uh, let's get rid of the cultist first. I suppose. I don't need any more blocks, so we can just do some extra damage here. I do enjoy blocking and then having thorns where they just damage themselves. Well, there's Noxious Fumes. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be good, though, with acrobatics. Yeah, this is going to be good with acrobatics. I like this. All right. Let's start with acrobatics. Nice. We get a free sneaky strike. That's good. Get rid of our... Defend, probably. Oh, this one. Oh, but I can discard it with prepared. Oh, this is good. This is good. Now we're fucking comboing. Let's get rid of this. Okay, we can sneaky strike for free. This is good. Sneaky strike for free. Do it right this time. Um, now we can uh, cast deadly poison. Um, oh, that does eight damage already, and then the poison's gonna kill it. So I'm gonna do that on you. You're gonna die, poison you. And then we prepared and discard tactician, and it's gonna regen. gonna regen our energy, but do I need any more block this turn? It's gonna hit me for one only, so maybe I don't need the block this turn. Let's see what random skill we get. Acrobatics, draw three cards, all right, all right. Discard one, it's happening. Oh man, draw until you have seven cards in your hand. I needed this, I needed draws like this on the freaking boss. Oh my gosh. 
Um. Holy moly. Am I gonna wanna use Metamorphosis? I don't think so, because I'm already doing double damage this turn, so we should just use that while I can. This one's already poisoned. This one has seven poison. Oh, what's a good order to do this in? I don't think I need the block. I guess Metamorphosis and then drawing would have actually been smart because I would have drawn a lot of zeros. Yeah, actually, I should have used Metamorphosis and then drawn a bunch of cards, I think. It would have been risky, though, because I would have had no more energy after that. Um... Just a question of if I want to use any more of these. I mean, I'm pretty, I'm pr I feel like I'm pretty set already here, but. What'll I draw? Is there anything I really want to draw? I draw a shame. <laughs> I'll maneuver, I'll maneuver would be okay to draw. <laughs> but I may not draw anything of particular use this turn. So, well, it'll probably be better than there's seven cards in your hand. This guy's gonna die from the poison. I do want to like apply more stuff to this guy while I have double damage. I think I'm gonna play expertise. I think I'm gonna play noxious fumes. Oh, at this. Oh, it's at the start of my. I think I misunderstood that one too, but that's okay. Yeah, I did. Oh, I did. Never mind. Ah! Damn it. All right. Never mind. I did it wrong. That's okay. Suffer. Hex. What did Hex do to me? So he gains two poison at the start of my turn. Hex. Whenever you play a non-attack card, shovel one dazed into your draw pile. All right. Well, this guy's going to have hella poison. Yeah, it's just inflicting negative effects on me, but it has 15 poison and vulnerable. <laughs> so surely it surely it dies. Surely it dies soon to that poison. Okay, now it's gonna hit me. Oh, I'm drawing a bunch of dazed. Uh oh. <laughs> but hopefully we can just finish it off here. Oh good, I'm drawing dazed. Uh Oh, I don't think I, I think it had more HP than I realized. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh, it had more HP than I realized. And I have a hit. Do the days go into my deck? I think that's where I just got screwed right there. The days goes into my deck. Whoopsies. I did that a little wrong. Um, But nonetheless, it should be dead here. Just the poison is enough to kill it. I don't think anything else matters, but just in case I'm messing something up, let's just keep hitting it. Huh. Okay. It'll die to the point. Better die to the point. Alright. Uh, cost one less for each card discarded this turn. I like acrobatics. I really like acrobatics. Mm. Apply three poison to a random enemy four times. Poison is nice. Acrobatics can pop off. I'm gonna get acrobatics. I'm gonna get acrobatics and we're just preying on pure hope. We're, it's just pure luck right now. <laughs> we're just banking on pure luck. Oh, I restored 25 health at the start of a boss fight, by the way. Whoopsies. Maybe in that case, it would have been better not to kill. I don't know. I'll take the extra health. It's still fine. All right, let's go. Let's go. Whoa, artifact. Okay. Um, don't want to draw cards yet. We have some discard. Let's get this out of our hand. Um, choose a random skill card. I'll wait until I... Uh, applying Vulnerable would be great, though. If I... Yeah. Oh, it already negates three debuffs, though. So that won't do anything. All right. I think I'll... 
use a backflip to draw two, maybe? Tricky. Not sure what to do. Maybe I don't need any block. Let's start with this. Oh. Oh, I am hooked. <laughs> I am hooked. Hmm. Let's see what I draw. Oh, we're just drawing cards, but are we doing anything with them? <laughs> I don't know if I want to draw more cards. I think I'm playing this poorly. No. I'm weak anyway this turn. Maybe I just outmaneuver and poison it. Like, if I draw cards that do nothing, that's not helping me. Man, alright, I'm just gonna play out Maneuver and poison it. Oh, that negates the poison. That's interesting. Oh, it summoned minions. Alright. Well, we definitely want to use Metamorphosis. Yeah, darn. Didn't work out great. And it's just gonna negate the poison. I could, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna use the skill potion and see what happens. Maybe I'll get something cool. Draw one card. If you draw a skill, gain three block. Draw cards until you have six in your hand. That could be useful because I have a lot of do I have a discard in my hand right now? I do, but I don't need any more energy. I need more cards. Let's get expertise, and then let's play a bunch of shit. And then we'll use expertise to draw cards again. Let's just work on getting rid of all those things, I guess, because I don't know what the fuck else to do. Um, and let's play survivor. Discard this. All right, draw six new cards. That's at least something. All right, uh, we're getting somewhere now. We're getting somewhere now. Zero mana, draw six, let's go. <laughs> All right, I can almost debuff this guy. If I throw this at him and then hit him with this, then I'll have 99 vulnerable on him, which feels like is a good play. So I'm gonna throw this potion on him and he's gonna block it. But now we're gonna play, put 99 vulnerable on him. Okay, if the enemy has weak, oh, okay. I don't think I have a weak weakness, do I? Deal five damage to all enemies twice. We like that. Apply weak! Hold on, we're gonna sucker punch this guy. And then we're gonna heal hook this guy. Ooh, we're kinda comboing right now. Let's go. Oh my god, dude! Holy shit, wait. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's dagger spray. Oh my god. Use enlightenment just to get it out of our hand. I think we just play this and draw six. I think that's the play. Fucking draw six. Let's go. Oh my god, dude. It's comboing. It's happening. Uh... Alright. Add a random skill to your hand. Let's read all of our abilities. But I think we do that one next. Noxious Thieves. Poison all those bitches. And these sneaky strikes are definitely going to be free. So we have free sneaky strikes. Let's get a skill, though. First. Uh, this turn, your next skill is played twice. Dude, draw eight, discard two. <laughs> or I can gain a bunch of block. I don't need the block. All right, burst. Time to draw eight and discard two. Wait, I can't draw that many cards, though. All right. Um, game doesn't let me. Let's use dagger spray. Free. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's probably get this cooking, though I should sneaky strike stuff. I wonder if I want to get rid of these little ones. I wonder how important that's going to be. Does this boss ever get a turn? No! <laughs> oh man. This feels like playing like a combo deck in Magic. Where your opponent's just sitting there with like the most bored look on their face as you try to figure out if you can win or not while they don't even play the game. Keck W. Um... I don't know what this is going to do with our double thing, but I should use this first because it's going to it's a free cast. Um, I just don't know if I should kill these little dudes or not. Minions abandon combat without their leader. 
But it's gonna like debuff me a shitload if I don't get rid of them. Hmm. We're just gonna send it on the automaton and see how it goes. All right, do I want to use anything first or do I want to just use this? We're gonna draw up to max card size and then discard two, I think. Let's just do this. Let's just do this. Discard shame. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> All right, <laughs> give my hand, holy shit. Oh, uh, sneaky strikes are free. Next turn we'll do double damage. That's nice. Too bad we didn't get that on already. Shit, man. What are we not going to be able to cast? We're only going to be able to cast two of these, so we should get rid of one of our... Maybe we get rid of dodge and roll. Though it does... I think I'm going to get rid of dodge and roll and just try to deal as much damage as I can. Um, oh wait, Tactician! No! <laughs> oh, I can still do it with this. I can still do it with this. We're still good. <laughs> Damn, I want to cast everything though. Oh. Wait, deal nine damage, draw a card. Hold on, let's start with this. Wait, can I draw a card? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, because it'll replace itself. So I can still do this. Let's just see what our other card is. Maybe we use prepared? And then we choose two cards to get rid of. We get rid of Tactician to gain more energy. Oh my god, this is so sick! Get rid of Defend and Tactician. Yo, let's go! <laughs> if the enemy has weak, gain an energy and draw a card! It's the infinite, dude! This thing has weak! Alright, let's strike it. And then deal and draw a card. Dude, it's po we're popping! Draw and discard. Infinite power! <laughs> oh shit. Aw. Oh. Damn, dude. Next turn, double damage. So that we don't have that this turn. Let's get this cooking. Get this cooking. Um. Right. It's more a question of do I want to just play everything? Oh, I have another quick slash, so we use that and draw a card. Dagger spray! Da, 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 <laughs> oh man. Alright. Do I want to kill these little guys? Deal 10. Draw one, discard one. It's a question of if I want to deal these little ones or just keep sending it on this guy. I'll play Noxious Teams, which will slowly work on those guys, but... I could, like, sneaky stab one and then dagger throw one, and it would kill it. Oh. I'm gonna kill one of them. I think. Let's see what I draw. I'm gonna kill one of them. Damn. Let's get rid of it. I don't know. This might be a mistake, but... Oh, I can't really kill it well. I could kill it with Neutralize and Sneaky Strike. I don't know, man. It might be a mistake, but I can cast everything, so... Because that won't poison it until later. And then I'm just going to poison Big Boy. I'm going to do Big Poison on Big Boy here. All right. Well, that was a turn. That was a turn. Does it play like 50 cards in a turn? <laughs> Let's see how bad Stasis is. Oh, it took a card from me? And on death, it's returned to my hand or something like that? Hmm. Well, back to doing nothing. Um, Apply one week is nice, though. What are you going to do? Block and buff. Man, I got, all, I got all the defense, but it's just going to block and buff. Um, are you gonna... It's going to block. I think it'll probably increase this guy's block. I could just finish this one off, maybe. 16 and 14. It would finish this little one off. I hope he doesn't just summon a new one if I do that, though. That would suck. But he is taking lots of poison damage, so why don't we just do it? Let's get rid of this nerd. Oh. 
for oh yeah i killed it on this turn your next skill is played twice well having dodge and roll play twice is nice because it'll help us in future turns all right that's fine at least let's go and the poison is cooking on this guy all right uh, Dante has seven cards in your head <laughs> Oh, we like to see that. We like to see that. All right, let's get this one out of our hand. We don't, maybe next turn though. Oh. Let's play. I could just poison stab it and then draw just to, in case I have to spend energy to discard and then use others and then use my um, energy refilling things. So it's tempting. It's tricky there it's not even gonna hurt me I have so much block so let's just use expertise right now and see what we get shame <laughs> acrobatics is good though uh, sneaky strike is not active yet though so let's use act let's use acrobat oh yeah this is why I was thinking of not doing this damn it yeah darn it darn it if I had done it in a different order uh, let's get rid of shame Right, wait, do I have a tactician? Oh, if I had drawn a tactician right there, that would have been nice. I could, I might get a tactician with that acrobatics though. We can check the deck. We can check the deck. <laughs> oh no, there isn't one in it. How are you liking silent? I like the craziness of this. It's very silly for sure. I'm thinking about just poisoning the shit out of it to be honest and then just calling it a day. We can dagger spray it. Um. It feels like the play here is to either use outmaneuver, I think just deadly poison, because it's already at 12 poison stacks, and it's not going to do any damage to us right now. So why don't we just poison the shit out of it, and then wait for next turn, because I think I have double damage next turn. Yeah, it's kind of like an assassin character with a lot of block and ev I, I guess like sneakiness and evading damage makes sense. Dude, expertise is nuts. <laughs> It's just gonna buff. Question is, do we start with expertise and just take three cards? Uh, this is only 10 damage, okay. We haven't activated that yet. Let's start with expertise in case we get a... Okay, I didn't need to, but that's okay. Double damage next turn, sure. Draw two, discard two, and then we get a free sneaky strike. Um, I don't need any additional blocks, so let's get rid of that one. And then let's just use... We'll keep dodge and roll, though, because it'll help in future turns. Okay, we'll use sneaky strike, because it's free. And then we'll just use everything else. Mmm. Mmm. All right, this character can really pop off, but our deck is inconsistent. <laughs> 20 poison damage, let's go. 51, but that's okay, I think we'll kill it. Or we won't, we'll see. Maybe we'll just shame. Uh, let's use survivor and discard our shame. Now we have a free sneaky strike with double damage. Yeah, we'll kill it. Double dagger spray, let's go! <laughs> let's go. And we got the shame too. Man, this deck popped off and we still had the shame in it. That was really fun. That was really fun. Malaise. Wait, enemies lose X plus one strength, apply X plus one weak. Okay. Whenever you play a card, gain one block. Okay, that's like a lot of cheap block. Burst is nice. Your next two skills are burst with the card draws. Kind of nuts. <laughs> uh, they get weak and lose strength. Is the strength just for one turn or is that a permanent loss of strength? Hmm. I could see this really coming in handy as I'm like poisoning shit and then I just make sure I don't die. Um, 
Yeah, does 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 strength uh, option does the when it loses strength, does that strength um immediately get returned to them or it's permanent? Oh, permanent sounds nice. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. That could really come in handy. I like the other options too, though. And we got an item! Yay! Uh, oh my gosh! You get an extra energy, but you can no longer see enemy intents. Whoa! That would be good if you were really good at the game. Uh, at the end of your turn, you no longer discard your hand. What? With this deck, that's crazy! Um, upon pickup, remove two. I mean, I have to do this fucking runic pyramid. I have to do it. I have to do it. <laughs> Just for the memes, if nothing else, I have to do it. <laughs> Uh, it's actually not even good with 10,000 hours into the game. Wow. I have a lot of money, so a shop wouldn't be bad here. I can get one either way, though. Let's just start up the middle. I feel like there's more options there. And then we'll maybe go to that shop. Explosive thorns! <laughs> Wait. I beat Act 2, right? I'm on Act 3 now. Makaro beat Act 2, yes. Alright. Will I beat Act 3? This game is so fun! This deck is cool. I mean, even though there's a little bit of shame going on here, it's a cool deck. Um, reduces the cost to one. Alright, nice. Start out with some nice enlightenment. Oh, uh, let's do be let's do prepared and then discard our shame card so that doesn't end up in our hand. And then what else? We got a lot of damage coming at us, but I don't foresee myself wanting to use def this simple defend anyway, though. We can gain some energy back with our sneaky strike, which is sick. Yeah, we have another defend anyway. All right, so sneaky strike is net one energy right now. So let's play metamorphosis, I think. Or I wanna play survivor. Metamorphosis is fun. I like getting all these weird cards. Flying me! Okay, now we can Sneaky Strike. Oh, it's, it's really a shame that we start each turn with Weakened. If we had simply gotten better luck there, that would have made a big difference, I feel. What does this have? In three turns, explodes. All right, we don't want that. Let's take care of that one first, then. We don't want this one exploding all over us. Um, and let's neutralize probably the heaviest hitter so that deals less damage um noxious fumes would be nice to get cooking but i feel like i should also i should probably get some block here so the question is do we play deadly poison to this one just to get it down or do we do noxious fumes for late two poison to all enemies maybe it's not going to be as much as i want it to be because it's not going to even start until next turn. I say we just get this one cooking right now. And then we get a, get additional block going here. So we don't take as much damage. Okay. I don't know if it would have been good to play that Noxious Streams or not, but I felt like it felt like it wasn't going to pay off fast enough, but we'll see if that ends up biting me or not. Because it would have refreshed this to 8, so maybe it would have been better in the long run. Oh wow, Malaise though. It's interesting. Like, stop them from doing all their damage. Do I have double damage this turn? No, I don't. Um... Interesting. I kind of want to play... I could just kill this with strikes, though. Mm. I do need to worry about this explosion, but I don't think it's going to happen. I'm going to just cook for next turn and hope it turns out. <laughs> Let's just... Oh, is it only one of them? Oh, shit! I thought it was all enemies! That's still good on bosses, but I didn't understand that ability. Oopsies. Um, well, in that case, let's kill this one, because it'll die to the poison next turn. Yeah, the six. Oopsies. I thought that was all enemies. Um, and then... Well, 
two strength and two weak. Or do we just do seven damage just to get this one dying? Damn, I didn't understand that ability. Let's just work on killing this one. Does it even... Oh, it'll still do one. I guess that doesn't matter much. Sure. Strength is cool because it's like permanent. Right. Oh, this one is going to gain poison, though. I wonder... It says when attacked. If I could put poison on that one, it would be nice. Because then it's not going to thorns the shit out of me. Oh, good days. Um, dang, didn't get any card draw. I think I'm going to apply poison to you so it stops spiking me and just let the... Oh, I really should have played the poison. Now that I know what these guys do, playing the, the ramping poison ability would have definitely been the play. I think I forgot that these guys mainly use uh, status effects and then they slowly build this shit over time. So, sadly, um... Oh, maybe there's some hope, though. Let's see what we get for backflip. Yes! Okay, wait, we're still cooking. Now let's play acrobatics. We're still cooking. Discard our days. Yes, we can just deadly poison. Okay, we deadly poison this guy for sure. Doesn't even count as being attacked, so that's really nice. It doesn't... This thing doesn't bother us. All right, that's good. That's good. That's really good. Uh, let's dagger throw the small one. Don't need any more defense this turn. Finish off the small one before it inflicts a negative. And this one is just sort of buffing itself, but it'll die to those poisons, I think, eventually here. So let's just... Question is, do I want... I have five block. You know what? I have five block. I can take a hit here. That's fine. I have plenty of block for this. Okay. Oh, I should have done it the other way, though, because this one's only going to go down to one HP. Oopsies. I should have done it slightly different, so that one died. All right, cool. But anyway, that one's dying to poison, which is good. And it can gain as much thorns as it wants. I'm just getting a bunch of dazed from it. That should be okay. All right. Um, let's use our random skill. Next turn, draw X cards. Oh. Gain. I mean, that's cool, but not what we need right now. Finisher. Let's finish you off. And I don't think we need to do much here, to be honest. Because I don't need to take... I don't need to take a whole bunch of extra damage from this. I can just wait. Yeah, I can just wait. Unless it can one-shot it, but it can't, so... I'm going to play this for funsies. Uh, I don't think it's worth hitting it unless it's not going to do any damage to me. So... It's just going to die to the poison. Oh, it's going to hit for six. That's okay. I'll just block it. Can I do the... Oh, uh, maybe... Uh, I don't want to take seven damage, so I'm just trying to... Let's just cook for next turn. It doesn't matter. Because it's going to die to the poison. I'm blocking it. It's fine. I don't need to, I don't need to rush this guy. It's going to just die in two turns of the poison. And it's not hurting me. Now we can just... I think it'll still thorns me, so I'm keen to just let it die to... I'm keen to just let it die to the poison, because it's not even going to hurt me. I think I just passed turn twice, and it dies to the poison. Then I don't take any damage. Alright, cool. Um, a card to your deck. Ooh, Flying Knee Plus. This one's nice too, but there's some cases where I don't want this one. Like, it kind of, it's kind of a net loss of a card, because it, it's using a card up itself. So sometimes I don't like this one, but usually it ends up paying off and it helps me combo, so... I guess it's a question of a second one of these, versus... Something like this that's like, it really cooks on the first turn. Like, just starting off with a flying knee is great. I mean, any time it's great. So, um, oh, 
combos are great though. <laughs> Let's combo harder to the point where we're not actually doing anything. All right, I have 226 gold. Let's go see what's at that shop. Are we starting a deck builder roguelike era? I hope so, Federico. This is so fun. Love this game. Um, have you seen my courier? Wait, have I? I don't think so. Choose one of three random cards to add to your hand. It costs zero this turn. Put four random attacks from your draw pile into your hand? That's interesting. For zero. That's interesting. Um, draw one card. If you draw a skill, gain five block. I do have a lot of skills, but it's also, it's also questionable. Shiv. I feel like there's some way to combo with this. Um, oh, seven poison and two weak to all enemies. Uh, deal four damage. Whenever you draw this card, put a copy of it. Delay damage, draw a card. Let's check out this. We can afford this. Whenever you break an enemy's block, apply to vulnerable. That's interesting. Upgrade all cards in hand for the rest of combat. I do like that. So I have this thing that gives me five life every time I use a potion. So there's something to be said for some potions too. Like having this thing upgrade everything could be cool. Same with the attack potion. Card removal service, also good to just, um, I'm gonna use card removal service, I'm pretty sure, just to get rid of one of my basic blocks. But then I can't afford this one. Four random attacks from your draw pile into your hand. I think this has great potential with my deck because I don't have to discard cards. In your turn, you no longer discard your hand. This one could really cook with the thing that gives me three energy too. I like this card, but it costs a lot. Is there any card? Yeah, are there any cards that I really hate? I was gonna get rid of these defends. That would be good. Is there any card that is like actively sabotaging my deck? <laughs> um, wait! You could just get... Well, that's nice. <laughs> well, that's pretty nice. <laughs> um, but... God, this is nice. Draw a card. Mm. Do you like that? But I can't afford this anymore, which is sad. Poison deck timeline. Sell your guild today. Mm. Choose one of three random cards to add into your hand. Random cards that cause zero. <laughs> it's a cool idea. I like how this is only 23. I think I'm gonna buy this because I think it might save me. And this might also save me. But if I also get a potion soon, then that's no good. I'm gonna get a question mark next. Maybe I should save some money for the question mark. Sometimes they want money. It's hard not to just buy absolutely everything, though. <laughs> oh, YOLO, let's just buy all the shit. Let's just buy it all. Hmm. Card draw. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I probably shouldn't have bought that card. Alright, whatever. Let's go. I'm addicted to buying- I'm addicted to having bigger decks. And that's a bad idea. Navigating through the beyond, you discover a glowing Tesseract. I can't wait to have to spend money on it. Oh my gosh, this shit again. Colorless cards. What are they gonna do for me? Who knows? Oh man. I'll take two. <laughs> hey, I got violence! Let's go! Uh, uh, add two random colorless cards to your hand. Random. Shuffle five, wait, shuffle five random skills into your draw pile. Oh, that's like that other one. I mean, I'm probably just gonna take this. I feel like it has good synergy with my deck. Um, put any number of cards from your hand at the bottom of your draw pile. They cost zero. 
Ooh, that's interesting. So you like play them later for zero? Deal three damage, draw one card. Interesting. At the start of your turn, add a random colorless card into your hand. Oh man. I don't think I want to spend two on that, but it's kind of cool. Um, put any number of cards from your hand on the bottom of your draw pile. That's kind of nice for like, okay, I can't cast anything else this turn, but I can save the stuff I actually want for later. But it also takes up a slot, so like, maybe I just play this because it doesn't... This has no drawbacks, I feel. Well, except on like, enemies with thorns and shit, or ramping shield, then it does. Hmm. If I didn't have this fucking cursed mask, this would be such a good run. <sighs> Put any number of cards from your hand to the bottom. What a colorless cards do I have? Is this sorted by colorless in some way, or can I do that? Are they all at the bottom? No, they're sorted. I don't, they're sorted. I think it's the order that I acquire them in. I did good face, bad face. I, I felt like the game, I felt like I was about to lose, so I did it, but in retrospect, I shouldn't have. Um, the bottom. Wait, put any number of cards from your hand to the bottom of your draw pile. They cost zero. There's a weird way where I've, I have no cards in my deck and I put stuff on the bottom and then I play one of the cards that just immediately draws them up again, where this could be like super sick and then I play them all for nothing. There's like a weird way that I could see this working out for me. This is fun. This just sounds fun though. I want to get forethought. The demonic creature towers above you, spreads its wing wide, and howls with laughter. Dead bodies of a tribe surround you while the village is engulfed in terrible dark flames. The demon calls out, you really are the strongest. Now, did it just, did we just murderize a village? Oh, you can sort it. Okay. Ooh, the lifelink guys. I remember these. Hmm, cards. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. All right. Um, next turn we could deal double damage. We'll start with that. Hmm. Let's see. It's gonna hit for eight, so backflip wouldn't be bad. Do we have a discard? Yes. So we can discard and we can start sneaky striking for free, which is always nice. Uh, let's start with distraction too, in case we get something cool with it. This deck is so silly. Bullet time. You cannot draw additional cards this turn. Reduce the cost of all cards in your hand to zero this turn. Ooh, okay, we'll use that one last. That's cool, that's a cool card. Cause you like do all your card draw first and then you do that. Wait, I can literally play this and then that. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, I can play this for four random cards in my hand and then that to make them all cost zero. Holy moly, all right. We're, we're ready to cook here in just a second, I think. Um, let's, let's use prepared. And then I think I'm gonna discard forethought. I don't think I'm gonna use forethought this turn as much as it has potential. Let's get rid of that and let's focus on just murderizing things. Um, but you can't draw additional cards this turn. So we might get rid of that one. Because I'm going to use acrobatics instead. Okay. We can sneaky strike for free. So maybe we should just do that to get it going. Sneaky strike for free. And I think we want to play acrobatics now. Of our defend. Oh. Oh. Uh, four random attack cards from your draw pile into your hand. I might be doing this wrong if I have a hand limit. I'm still not sure how hand limits work. I'm gonna discard. <laughs> um. Yeah, I'm not quite sure how this is gonna work exactly. I feel like I can use two, or how much block do I have? None. So 
If, um, chat, I'd like an answer to this question. If I play violence, well, I already have a lot of cards in my hand. Is it going to not do it? Or is it going to let me discard ones? Will it just simply fail? Ten is hand limit. You draw until you have ten. So, okay, I need to make sure I don't... Okay, one, two, three. And then now I see why having the option somewhere to, like, show the amount of cards in my hand would be really good. Abandon, run. Wait, wasn't there an option for this that somebody mentioned to me? Extra cards, I'm sorry. Uh, show quick cards, quick select keys. Okay. Oh, okay, cool. It, like has the number of the card above them. I do like that. Okay, so I don't want to use this. Um, Can I draw additional cards this turn? It's also confusing to me whether bullet time would make violence not work anymore. Like if I played bullet time first and then used violence, because violence has put them into your hand. It doesn't say draw them. Whereas other cards uh, specifically say draw. So that's another like rules thing that I'm just kind of uncer uncertain how it's going to work. Um, okay, I think I want to do your instinct is right. Okay, cool. So it would work to play that. But just, I want to make sure that... I want to make sure I have everything in my hand ready to use. So let's apply weak to you. And just, the stuff that costs zero, let's just get out of my hand there. Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to use expertise in this round. It feels very difficult to try to make expertise work, though. I don't see you have seven. But I could cast two cards. Like I could cast Noxious Fumes. Um, and then casting Expertise is kind of mid. One, two, three, four, five. I would only draw two cards. And what is the chance it's just going? It's going to be something that I actually want to use. Maybe it's worth it though. Um, because it's all going to be zero. Reduce the cost of all cards in your hand is zero. I mean, I think I play expertise, and then I play bullet time, and then I just, and then I, assuming it works, right? I can play violence after bullet time, correct? I, I just wanted to make sure I got that right. If that's correct, I'm going to play bullet time first and then violence. Um. Hopefully I've done this right. Then there'll be zero. Oh, they won't be zero then. Yeah. Oh, I see how I've done it wrong. Ah, oh, dang it. That's okay. Okay, I see, I see, I see. They won't be zero then. Put four ran. Yeah, they won't be zero. All right, I had to just do it like that. That's okay. All right, well, we bullet time, and then this is fun at least. <laughs> this is at least fun. We get to do this. All right. We don't get to draw any more cards, though. Alright. Um, I'm just gonna pile up on this one. Oh, I still have to discard. That's kind of annoying. I didn't consider that when I used that ability. So the- I don't draw, but I still do the discard. Um, I think I do want to keep this defense so I don't take any damage, so I'm just gonna get rid of one of these strikes. Alright, whatever. We bungled it a little bit. Unless I kill it. If I kill it, then we wouldn't have needed to do that. Uh, looks like it just doesn't finish it off. So it's a question of do we poison one of the other ones and just let this one die to the regular poison? Or just to next turn? Poison one of the other ones. With the hope that it's not going to backfire me and do very much. Alright, that was interesting. Too bad I only drew like regular attacks though. All right, they're all poisons. That one's just gonna die. God, I love acrobatics so much. Let's use acrobatics. 
don't think that's going to help this turn. Though it does depend on what I draw with prepared. Um, however, I can't cast everything else anyway, so let's keep that in case it ends up mattering. And probably just pitch a defend. In case it ends up mattering. Because these guys are attacking for quite a bit here. Um, that one's going to die to the poison. I already have 7 block, which is good. Um, I think we see what we draw with this. Let's see how it goes. Do I want to... I could cast Metamorphosis for one. That's okay. Yeah. Whatever I use, it's not going to be those two. So I could use Metamorphosis for one. I do like Metamorphosis quite a bit. Um, then it's a question of... Maybe I should have saved a little more block, though. Hmm. Would I rather have Metamorphosis or Outmaneuver? Both could have advantages. I've only got six cards left, so I'm probably going to draw most of these. So I'm just going to get them. Um... And then, sadly, I think, play this so we don't get... We're still going to take a little more damage than I want. Yeah. Maybe I should have used my dex potion or something right there. It's okay. Oh, take a little more damage than I wanted. Oh, yeah, they regrow. Oopsies, I got to be careful. I forgot they regrow. Oopsies. I need to be careful there. Uh, deal 16 damage next turn. Oh, deal 16 damage next turn. Draw two additional cards. Um, lifelink. If other enemies are still alive, revive in two turns. Oopsies. I shouldn't have finished that one off. I wasn't paying attention to that. Shit. Uh, what can we do here? Deal 8 damage three times. We can do a lot of damage here. Play a lot of attack cards. No draws though, right? Yeah. Dang. Okay. Um, might not have done that in the best way. It's going to take five from poison. Eight damage three times. So that would finish it off. Hmm. Would anything else finish it off? Five plus 14. Not quite enough there. I might just be regrowing these dudes, which isn't great. <sighs> Let's let the poison do as much as we can to them. Um, let's poison the shit out of this one. And then... <laughs> I don't know if this is going to regrow this turn or next turn, but I kind of messed that up a little bit with letting those guys regrow too much. This one will be at 1 HP from the poison, which is probably ideal because it won't die this turn, but it'll die in the turn after that. And then I think we do this to cook for next turn. Um, block doesn't matter, so... I guess it's too much. Sure. Yeah, um... Oh, no, this is gonna be weird. If it revives this turn, it's a little bit unfortunate. But at least they're low. Yeah. At least it doesn't get a attack in. Alright. Well, we have lots of cards now. For each skill in your hand, you have five skills! Holy shit. That's gonna help. That one's... Oh, that one has 12 block, though. Shit, but it has 13 poison. Well, that's pretty nice. Boom. <laughs> that one's gonna die to the poison. Let's put vulnerable on one of them. Um, 
This one needs more health, though. This one has 13 HP. This one's... Oh, it's kind of confusing, but... Probably 7 poison. If I exhaust you... Will you die to the poison with this? Deals 10 damage. That'll die to the poison now. Okay, we should be good here. Yeah. We'll just apply everything to you, and then the other one will just die to the poison. They'll all just die to the poison. I hope I've calculated that properly. I think I have. Hopefully I've calculated that properly. Yay, they all died. Okay, whew. Acrobatics. Riddled with holes, deal three damage, five times. Not very good. I mean, acrobatics is so fun. I do like flying me, but acrobatics. Whew. Mm. <laughs> when you start a hand with two acrobatics in it. Oh, man. What a turn this is going to be. Um, well, next turn will be nice, too. No play, only draw. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. Enlightenment might come in handy. If we can draw something good. Um... Oh yeah, this one. Right, this one has thorns, but is annoying. This one negates a whole lot of debuffs. Deadly poison. I think I want to use deadly poison on this one. For sure, Aziz. Let's use um, our zero costs first, I think. Do I actually want to apply vulnerable to anything though with these three debuff things? It'll work on this one. Let's apply vulnerable to this one because it'll actually work eventually on it. Now a question I have right here is do I want to play prepared first and see what I draw? I think I do. I play prepared first. Oof. Um, I'm assuming alignment doesn't affect malaise. I don't think I want malaise right now. It's nice for bosses, but I don't think I want it here. Flying weak to this wouldn't be the worst thing. Um, but I'll just use deflect and it won't hurt me anyway this turn. So let's get rid of that. I think I get rid of strike because I don't do very much damage this turn anyway. And then we see what starts cooking with acrobatics. Nice. Let's get rid of defend. Let's use deflect. Get our shield cooking. So now I won't take any damage. Um, I think I want to apply noxious fumes just because it's going to help with this guy. I also want to deadly poison it. I was kind of hoping to draw some energy gain though. Um, I can play acrobatics still because I'll go down to six cards and then draw to ten. So let's play acrobatics. Oh my goodness. Forethought. Put any of your cards to the bottom of your draw pile that causes zero. So it doesn't look like... Oh, I could... Violence plus Enlightenment is an interesting combo, I guess. Um, but maybe it'd be better next turn. Maybe I play Outmaneuver, and then next turn I really go for everything. I think I cast Outmaneuver, yeah. And then I'll worry about everything else next turn. How does card draw work? Do I draw five cards each turn? Because I have nine cards in my hand right now. Should I, I'm, do I draw nine, uh, five additional cards no matter what my hand size is? I, well, of course, I can't go over 10 though.
You draw five cards up to max. Thank you. So I think what I want to do is I want to play Forethought. I definitely want to cast out Maneuver for next turn. I think I want to play Forethought and make sure I'm still drawing five cards, basically. Mm. And I think Outmaneuver is the one I want to cast this turn. So let's cast out Maneuver. And then let's use Forethought. Just to get cards out of my hand, because I'm going to draw five anyway. And then if I ever do get to them, they'll be free. But if anything, it lets me draw more cards next turn. Which is nice. Yeah. Um, Because I don't want this right now. I guess oh, applying Noxious Fumes would have been useful too, but that's okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I just want to maybe get rid of this. And I'm going to keep Violence and Enlightenment so that they can combo together. If nothing else. Alright, and I'll draw five more cards next turn, which is nice. And I'll take no damage. Okay. And next turn we'll have a whole bunch of extra energy. So that sounds good. Oh, the days! That's right. <laughs> That's okay. This thing has 65. <laughs> Alright, but we're doing double damage this turn now. And so we really should be able to do a lot here. Um, can I gain energy? See how I have 6 out of 3 energy? If I discard Tactician, will it give me even more out of 3 energy? Like it'll... That's pretty nice if that's how it works. If you have discarded a card this turn, yeah, okay. Nice. All right, let's work on killing this guy. Deal 20 damage, draw one, discard one. Uh, because I can discard a uh, tactician. So that puts me up to seven. Very nice, very nice. Um. Let's apply weak to you. Oh, it won't actually apply. That's okay. I need to get the card out of my hand. Um, this one is free, but I can play it later with Enlightenment to gain energy if that is useful. I'm not sure it will be here because I don't have any card draw, sadly. Well, I just so we're just gonna play down, play card, play our cards down a little bit, use violence, and then make everything cost one. Oh yeah, it will make sneaky strike cost one, so we can gain some energy with that too. That's nice. Um, so we still need to use another card first here. Um, let's apply Deadly Poison to this one, because that's what's going to actually kill it in the end here. And then let's just get Noxious Fumes out as well, because that's going to slowly kill those guys as well. All right, I think now we play Violence and then we play Enlightenment. Four random attacks and reduce the cost if we need to. Nice. All right. Yeah, and we play alignment, and now sneaky strike gives us energy, which is pretty sick. I think. You're gonna do a negative effect. You're gonna hit me for ten. The downside here is I think I might take some damage unless I can kill this guy, but I think I should be able to kill it. So maybe we go for that because it's gonna prevent the damage just by killing it. Yeah. Got seven energy, nice. Yeah, we killed it, no problem. Let's just kill it with a strike. Cool. All right, now we're not gonna do any damage. That's good. Um, let's draw some cards. Distraction. Add a random skill. Sure. Dodge and roll. Yay. Sure. <laughs> uh, I think I don't do anything here, and I let this one just die. We can kill this one. Though. Yeah, yeah, we can kill this one. But oh, I have four shield, so I could still st I could still poison stab this. Yeah, cause it won't hurt me. I still have enough shield. Okay, cool. Now we just wait. What a cool deck, right? <laughs> this is cool. This is still my second run, yes. So it's gonna keep buffing its thorns, but it'll just die to the poisons. We can apply more poison. Oh, it is gonna actually hit us for seven this turn though. Um, let's just block that. Apply more poison. And just let it die from the poison. Yeah, just let it die from the poison. It won't hurt me. 
Yay! Ooh, it's such a shame we have this stupid mask. I wonder if there's some way to get rid of it. Oh, I do like this. Oh my gosh, another Noxious Humes. <laughs> Dagger spray, six damage to all enemies twice. Doc just seems it's weird. Like, I like it. But I also like zero casting cost to seven block. <laughs> uh. I'll take that. Zero casting cost block. All right, we're going in. We have a minion fight that we can't avoid here, or an elite fight. Let's go. Ooh. All right. Looks like we have an interesting hand. Let's pop a deflect. Yeah, because it's going to deal damage to us. We can just get a bunch of block out. All right. And then acrobatics time. Let's see what we draw. Backflip. Let's get rid of one of these defends. Probably. Is there a, no tactician or anything bad to get rid of? Okay. Nice. Well, we can at least... Uh, let's use prepared. We have so many defense that we don't really need right now. We've already got 14 block. Let's see if we can find something nice here. Let's get rid of probably two defense. I'm not going to have enough mana to use all these strikes anyway. Enough energy. Let's see if we can draw anything else interesting. Nope. <laughs> All right. Mm. All right, let's use enlightenment. Oh wait, I can still draw two cards with backflip. Hold on, we're not done cooking yet. Let's draw two more cards with backflip. Oh, <laughs> oh man, um, hmm. Well, I don't want. I, I want to make sure I don't take any damage from it. Nineteen. I'm not gonna take any damage from it, so that's good. So we can just do whatever here. I really like using Metamorphosis. Um, so it'd be nice to use Enlightenment and then Metamorphosis. Any other way I want to play it? Do, is there any chance I want to use this instead? I don't think so. I think I want to use Enlightenment and then I want to use Metamorphosis because then we're going to get some good attack cards coming into our deck. And of course, we could try to draw them right now with Violence, but why not just apply Deadly Poison and then go, go next? Because I don't do as much damage this turn anyway because of this stupid mask. So... Oh no, maybe we do Noxious Fumes to get it ramping. Let's start with Noxious Fumes to get it ramping. Okay, and that's perfect, because I have five cards, so we'll draw up to ten next turn. Let's go! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh man, this deck. 45, though, so... That's certainly going to be something. Applying weak sounds very good, so let's start by applying weak here, probably. Um, Alright, that lowers it to 33, but that's still... Still a lot of damage. We can get 13 block here, and we can restore some life here if we need to. Upgrades all your cards. We could use something like that if we need to. Let's think if we're going to need to or not. Four random cards in your draw pile. There are a lot of interesting things I can draw. It's just a question of if I want to play one of these potions first, or if I want to maybe try to save the potions. It's hard to know until it's too late with this deck, because I don't know what I'm going to draw. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to draw. Reduce all damage taken and H. Reduces all damage taken and HP loss. 
to one this turn. What? Oh, fuck this guy. <laughs> this guy is fucked up. This guy is fucked up. <laughs> Reduce all damage taken in H. So it's intangible this turn. So I can't do shit to it this turn anyway, and it's mainly just about surviving. Uh, I'm gonna use my dex potion. Which gives me five health. And then this is gonna help me get more block, but I feel like we're still kind of boned here, which is not good. Okay, 10 block there, seven block there. I might need to... I'm gonna use Flying Knee to get it out of my hand. Yeah, it only does one damage to it. But I think it's important to get that out of my hand. Um, we'll see how what else we can do here. I'm hoping to be able to use Expertise. So let's use Defend against some block and let's use this. Discarding one of our Strike cards, I think. Yeah. Okay, this will at least draw us three cards and there's some hope we can get some more block in there. We're not gonna die at least, but it's still kind of fucked up. The other thing I could do is like cast Deadly Poison or Outmaneuver. They probably Outmaneuver. Cast Outmaneuver and then I would draw an additional card. But that would also use all of my energy, so. Let's use Expertise first, just to see what we draw. Oh, we did get Acrobatics. <laughs> but I don't know how we're gonna make use of it. Let's see what's left in our deck. Um, we could still draw a Deflect, which would be nice to grab right now. But other than that, do 15 damage next turn. Oh, there is a... No, I don't wanna, I don't think I wanna draw too many cards right now. I mean, there's some things that could help though. Malaise. Certainly wouldn't hurt. Uh, it would be a little. It's a little risky though to try to draw more cards right now. I think, but I don't have the energy to use them. I feel like we outmaneuver and we fucking tank it. It's kind of shit though. It's gonna hurt so bad. But next turn we'll hopefully be able to finish it off. I don't know how to combo this otherwise. Yeah, there's like I could I could start drawing like these zero cast so if I use like violence friends I could get these like zero casting cost dagger throws and then hope that that I draw into like my deflect or into something that allows me to do other stuff but it's risk it's too risky I think I just play out maneuver and then next turn we'll win but I mean hopefully we'll win I don't know next turn we just have some hope but we're gonna take a lot of damage this turn! <laughs> oh man, that thing is fucking crazy, dude. It hits you for fucking 40 in the face. Jeez. All right. Now it's much more reasonable. And of course we get the deflect, but what else? Let's get that cooking. Uh, we need some discard. We do have discard there. Do I have any other discard? Yeah, we have a bunch of acrobatics. Okay, let's apply some deadly poisons to it. And then let's wait apply another deadly poison. And then use acrobatics. Use acrobatics. We can discard tactician to gain two energy, so let's do that. I think we're going to be able to hope, hopefully win this turn. It'd be nice to apply um, apply the thing that makes me do more damage. We're close to drawing it. So maybe we try to draw it with like dagger throw or quick slash. Yeah. Let's see what we draw with dagger throw. Let's use quick slash first. Let's see what we draw. Distraction, let's use that. Acrobatics! <laughs> oh my goodness. At least it costs zero though, that's nice. Let's use dagger throw, see what we get. Terror, that's what we wanted, that's good. Let's get rid of this strike. 
Let's apply terror to it. That's good. And then let's use this acrobatics first. Oh my god, zero casting dagger throws. Let's go. I might want to keep a defense so I don't take any damage. It's doing six times three. Yeah, let's keep a defend around just in case. Oh, we have dodge and roll though. Screw defend. Dodge and roll is going to be better. All right, let's use these dagger throws probably. Anything else we want to use? Next turn, draw two additional cards. Actually, let's use this and let's use acrobatics. Yeah, there we go. All right. Uh, Forethought is interesting because it is the bottom of my deck now. Violence is weird. Maybe I should have used it already. I probably should have. Uh, Monster Bash, thank you so much for the sub. Holy shit, so much energy. Oh. Stuff's costing zero because of... Um, there's a card that I use that shuffles a bunch of zero costing attacks into your deck. Um... Oh, I think it's Exiled, or whatever it's called. Wait, choose a card to discard? I still need to do that. Um, what don't I want to use this turn? <laughs> Deal 15 damage, discard all non. Maybe I'll just get rid of Forethought. Do I have any more draw? I do want to make sure it doesn't hurt me too much. Yeah. Uh, I could use Forethought to make something cost zero and then immediately draw it with Dagger Throw, by the way. Which is just kind of weird. It's like I like gain net energy with Sneaky Strike by Forethoughting it, Sneaky Strike, into the deck and then drawing it with Dagger Throw. And then if I get to my... Will, viol will violence take stuff from my discard pile if there aren't any in my drop? If there aren't four in my draw pile? I don't quite understand how that works. No. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna... Well, this wouldn't be bad to cast on it, but... It's hard to know what to do this turn. If I dagger throw once, then I believe it will go to my new deck. Then I could use violence, I believe. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this card, but it's it's a toss up because I think that might come in. That really might come in handy against this guy, if depending on how this turn goes. I'm hoping I can find some way to start using dagger throws though, and then. Uh, Because uh, now my deck is gone, right? So maybe I just get rid of this. Yeah. I think if I draw again... Well, these sneaky strikes are free. So let's use the sneaky strikes for free. That's nice. We can do a lot of damage here. It has 17 poison already. Um, zero. If I use dagger throw, will it shuffle that in? I'm hoping, I'm wanting it to shuffle everything in so I can play violence. I'm wanting it to shuffle everything in. There it goes, from your draw pile. I just wanted to get everything shuffled in. Oh, tactician, you love to see that. Now I can play violence. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I just wanted it to shuffle everything in. There we go. All right, the top deck. All right, we should just be able to kill it this turn then. Yeah, we can just kill it. Unload. <laughs> Whatever. Die! All right, we did it. <laughs> Unlimited power. Ink bottle, whenever you play 10 cards, draw one card. I like that. And then we got some liquid memories. Nice. I do like liquid memory. Choose a card in your discard pile and drift your hand. It causes zero. That can really, really help me. That guy sucks. Yeah. Violence was the answer. Burst. Escape plan. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know if I need another copy of Expertise in my deck, to be honest. I think I have enough, but... Burst is so funny. 
your next two skills are played twice. It's the next two. Burst plus. My gosh. That could... <laughs> this is very silly. Uh, I kind of want to get burst. This deck is getting really complicated. It's fun, though. All right. Do we want question mark and then... I think question mark and then heal up. Because honestly, I kind of need to heal up. Let's do it. A gremlin is shuffling about. The monster seems a harmless one. You approach out of curiosity. 12 cards. Match them to keep. Five tries, no do-overs. Are you ready? What? Is this a matching game? Match them to keep them. Remaining attempts, five. I mean, this is kind of just RNG, isn't it? <laughs> All right, chat. Remember where they are. Doubt. Ah! I don't want that card. Why would I want that? I could... Okay, there's... Da okay, so this is a curse and this is dagger throw. Gain two artifact? That makes it so I'm resistant to debuffs. <sighs> okay, there's our other doubt. We don't want that. We don't want that. Doppelganger. Next turn, draw X plus one and gain X plus one energy. That could come in handy as like a prep move on turn one. Okay, we can get a dagger throw if we want with this. I don't know if I need more dagger throws. I already have a lot of them. Let's see what this is. Neutralize. So somewhere in here is a doppelganger, a neutralize, uh, whatever that thing was. Ooh, blur. Gain eight block. Wait, I didn't see what it is. Well, let's just see what this one is. And whatever it is, we get to match if we want it. Neutralize. I mean, I don't hate neutralize. Applying weak sometimes helps me a lot. All right. Could have had doubt. All right, that was interesting. I would like to upgrade, but it just really feels like we need the health on this character. And then, is this a chest? Yeah. Nice. Paper crane. Enemies with weak deal 40%. Hey, there we go. Combos with the thing we just got. Good, good, good. I only have 89, so... I'm feeling like we do an upgrade here rather than go to the shop. Because we only have 89 gold. What can we upgrade that would be nice? Noxious flames. Sneaky strike is just more damage. Hmm. Or do we just take the health? Maybe not a bad idea to take the health here. Does it apply too weak? That's nice. That's nice. Doesn't draw any additional cards to upgrade that. Doesn't draw any additional cards to upgrade that. I do worry that my cards are a little weak, but... Since it's so hard to gain life on this character, I think I'm just going to take the life. Because we're about to fight a minion anyway, so we probably need it. <laughs> Oh boy. All right, here we go. Here we go. Well, we could do some free sneaky stabs. Maybe we can get rid of these little guys. We can poison everybody. Apply weak to one of them. Um, how do we want to start off? Maybe start off with this? Is there anything I really want to discard right now, though? Alignment might not come in handy. It depends, though. Hmm. This girl is so mean. Ah! I'm scared. Nine cards in my hand. Let's start with prepared and see what we can find here. Oh good, we have it prepared. <laughs> Blaze is so hard to know whether this character is going to be doing things, doing dastardly things to me or not. Like if it's gonna hurt me a lot, this would be great, but I don't know if it's going to. A 
So I think I'm gonna get rid of it and enlightenment. No, wait, we want to use enlightenment. Enlightenment is net energy gain with sneaky strike. Now that we've discarded cards, we don't want to do that. Okay. No, we don't want to do that. Let's get rid of this. Yeah. We can go for net energy gain here with sneaky strike. If we play enlightenment. And then sneaky strike will give us energy. I think we try to get rid of some of these daggers. It really sucks having this weak turn one. Oh my gosh. Okay, I like that though. Now we can acrobatics. See what we get. Oh, burst. <laughs> we do love burst. We do love burst. Uh, probably get rid of strike. Your next two skills are played twice. Lots of block, lots of energy is a cool combo. Any other skills? We could also dodge and roll twice, or like apply deadly poison twice. We could burst and then just apply a fuckload of deadly poison to the Reptomancer. But I think the safe thing to do is probably I'd probably use use it on dodge and roll. Burst, dodge and roll. Um. Outmaneuver is cool to do it with too, though. Next two skills are played twice. So let's use burst. Um, Dodger roll is going to give us a fuckload of block because it's applied twice. Yeah. 12 now, 12 later. We like that. Um, let's weaken that one so it does less damage to us. And then... Uh, question of I think we probably play out maneuver here and noxious flames but we could yeah I think we play out maneuver here and then noxious flames for next turn that's gonna give us this ass load of energy hope probably too much energy but let's play noxious flames okay and I'll save the deflect for later we don't need to use it this turn Flames? Oh, what a noxious fume, sorry. I got a wound card, what a nerd. I got a wound card. All right, maybe I do want to get rid of those. Oof. Yo, we got acrobatics though. And everybody's poisoned, so that's gonna, the poison should, the ramping poison should be good. To get rid of the nerds. Oh, how much damage is coming at me? A fuckload, so. Probably a decent idea. We have 10 energy though. Let's start doing shit. Apply seven poisons. Let's get poison cooking on her. Um, and let's get, probably, I think I should kill these ones doing 25 though. That's a lot. <laughs> should probably just kill those. So let's make sure that this one dies. I believe it will. It has five poison on it and five HP. So I really hope that one just dies. Minion. Mm. All right, we can cast acrobatics now, since we'll go to max hand size, and uh, probably just get rid of one of these defends. Forethought is not helpful right now, unfortunately. No, we have a lot of defend. Not a whole lot else going for us. Let's see if we can take out this other one. I hope killing them is an okay strategy. She's going to start taking a lot of poison damage, which is nice. Um, let's kill this one so it doesn't hit us for 25, though. KK, thanks. Uh, though I do have a buttload of... I do have a buttload of block. I've already got 12 on. This one will die to that, so I'm not going to take any damage. I don't need to use any more block right now. Um, I may as well use one more thing though, cause... Is there any... I don't see the value in this right now. Like, I could put this defend there for later, but... Or I could put the, the survivor there for later, but... I just want to make sure I draw five cards next turn. I have so many def... I have so much defense right now. I guess I don't know what she's gonna do, but it does say not attacking. Um, 
Use a card in your discard pile and return it to your hand. I'm gonna try to save my potions for now, but I definitely could do could use these potions if we need to here. But right now we're gonna draw five cards. Let's just leave it at that. And then my poison is ramping, which is good. So she's just summoning more minions. And getting all these wounds might be very bad. Um, let's apply terror to her so we can actually finish her off here. We need to start actually killing her. Um, Metamorphosis is going to be real helpful for us here. Apply one weak. Let's apply the weak to this one so it doesn't do nearly as much damage. Um, definitely need to use Metamorphosis. Shovel five random attack cards into your draw pile. Yeah. All right, got lots of good attack cards coming up now. How do we not die in the meantime? I'm thinking I poison the shit out of her and then just tank this, but it's a little bit sketchy. She's attacking this time too. I have a ton of defense though, but then we're gonna need to start getting more stuff though. And I can also use stuff like liquid memories if I need to. Let's get her all nice and poisoned up. Do I kill the little ones? This has three poison on it. I could kill this one. But I'm worried about all those wounds, to be honest. But also just getting a ton of poison on her is gonna end up killing her in the long run, so I like getting that all that poison on her just so that we eventually are actually killing her. Oh, well, we have a lot of block. We're gonna need it, though. Whew. It's still 13 times 2, which is not... There's still a lot of damage coming in. <laughs> mm. There's still a lot of damage coming in. Maybe I should have used an upgrade or something. Uh. more damage coming in that I'd like. I could, um... I don't have one of the ones that draws my hand up to seven. I'm gonna must, I must get that next turn. I can try to combo this. So I could use liquid memories and draw acrobatics and try to just like fucking combo off. Let's figure out how much damage I'm actually gonna take here. Cause I do have my Tori, but will it actually matter? I don't know what order they're going to attack in, necessarily. But... I'm going to take a decent bit of damage here. Uh, she's basically going to chew through my shield. And then I'm going to take, like, 20 damage. Um... Do I want to use liquid memories now and try to prevent some of that or wait? Oh, I'm going to take it because I gained 25 di I gained 25 life when a boss fight starts. So losing about 25 life is okay. It does kind of suck that I'm getting weakened though and all this crap. All right. Well, now we have a lot of good stuff to do though. So... Double damage next turn. It's a shame we didn't draw that yet, but they're hitting for a lot. So we do have to deal with that, but I, hopefully we can deal with this. It really sucks that I'm weak currently. Let's use distraction. Adrenaline. Okay. We like that. Okay, good. We have some good combo potential this turn. Especially because Sneaky Strike is going to just straight up gain two energy. It's really unfortunate that I'm weak. I can probably use, I could use Forethought potentially here with, uh, if I use Forethought and then drop to seven, it's kind of interesting. 
But I also have violence, so... Let's get rid of this one. Let's make sure that we get rid of this one. So that we don't take any horrible amount of damage from it. Uh, let's just finish it off. Actually, it only needs four damage. Do I have something small? Yeah, this is enough. Okay, that one we don't have to worry about anymore. So now we just have to worry about the 30 damage here. I think we'll be okay, hopefully, with enough of our draw cards here. Um, I think I want to use Expertise first. So Sneaky Strike is going to give us two extra energy, which is nice. Oh, had I not discarded? Oh no, I forgot to discard first. Oh, I don't think I had any. No, I did. No, I probably could have gotten it. Damn it. I didn't do it right. Hmm. Let's use Violence. Okay, now we only have four cards left in our deck. So we can sort of stack the deck here with Forethought and then draw them all up with Expertise. Um, if that works the way I think it does, and I hope it does. So I can make this sneaky strike zero. Deals three damage for each skill in your hand. Draw a card with that. All right, I think, how do I want to do this? I want to use stuff that costs zero. Yeah, I want to use stuff that costs zero to get cards out of my hand so that when I draw up to seven, then we draw as many as possible. Apply a fuckload of poison to her. Now I can forethought. I really hope this works the way that I want it to. Oh, they go to the bottom. I might not quite get them, right? Wait a sec here. I might not do, wait, this might not be working right. So Sneaky Strike is not glowing, so we haven't discarded yet. Damn it. I'll draw six cards. What else is in my deck? That more draw and more disc. Okay, we have an acrobatics. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. So if I use forethought and I put all these on the bottom, I hope I'm doing this right. Then I use expertise. I'll be able to draw all of them. There. That'll draw me seven new cards. And I'll be able to use acrobatics. Oh, here we go. Use acrobatics to get the rest of them. And then I can play, put Tactician down to gain... Whew. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> and now I can like Sneaky Strike, for instance, and just regain two energy, which is pretty snazzy. But I'm gonna start drawing the wounds now, which is not, uh, not ideal. All right. <sighs> Well, let's get what block we can get. Get what block we can get, because we're probably gonna have to tank 30 from her somehow in here. So, let's play acrobatics, and then let's, oh shit, we got another expertise. Let's discard the wounds. Discard the wounds. Nice, 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 we're fucking cooking, let's go. Playing weak is gonna be so big right now. Let's apply weak to her, now it's only 18. So, we're already cooking. We already, with this deflect, we're already, no, we're, we're breaking even now. We're breaking even. Uh, uh, let's draw some more cards. Double damage next turn. Apply some more poison to her. Sure, double damage next turn. Six damage draw a card, sure. Ah, oh, shit, the wounds. All right, let's draw two, discard two. Let's get rid of the wounds. Hmm. Get rid of a strike. All right, it might be useful to keep this full next turn, unless I can kill, unless I can straight up kill her this turn. Though we could go for another play with expertise, though. I think I should go for it. I don't need any more block this turn, assuming that this actually dies of the poison, like I really hope it will. So let's try to get rid of a card here. I don't need the block, so let's just do a damage, and let's play Expertise, we'll at least draw four cards. Oh. Um. 
I guess it doesn't matter that much. All right, we can gain a little bit of extra energy with Sneaky Strike here. So we can use Dagger Throw, see if we get something else. Let's get rid of this Defend. Just five damage twice. Oh, and I think we've got her now from the poison. Cool, we got her for the poison now. Okay, just in case there's bullshit, I'll play dodge and roll. Hopefully they just died of the poison. Whew! <laughs> That's so fun. Uh, I can't believe we have this stupid mask making our first turn shit in the deck that has great first turns. And we're still hanging on. Um, upon pickup, choose a power card. Oh, we're gonna have to, damn it, we have all these potions that we can't use. That's sad. I should have, you know what? I should have used the potions with the understanding that I'll probably get them. She's a power card. Start each, start each. Wait, upon pickup. No, wait, this isn't a. These turns are crazy. What a cool deck. Yeah. Um, upon pickup, choose a power card. Oh, it's not what I thought. Oh. Oh. Start each combat with this card in your hand. Oh! This is the only one I can choose because it's the only power card. <laughs> uh, um, and before this has a good power card. No, it didn't. All enemies lose eight strength this turn. That only applies to one turn, right? Um, Steal 12 damage, draw a card. I mean, that's not bad. Yeah, I didn't, I don't think I can get, I don't, I didn't know how to cancel this. I, I was too late. It was too late. Um, but I mean, that is a card that, of all the cards to play early, that's a good one to play early. So I'm not sure I want any of these cards. Um, all enemies lose eight strength this turn. Could save my ass on like a fight when there's tons of small things coming in. But if I recall, this boss is just one big fatty. So I think just drawing cards is good for that. So let's just keep up our card draw. Gain two energy, that could really come in clutch, but so can all these. Upgrade all cards. A random attack could save my ass too. So sadly, Sadly, I think we have to skip this potion. I definitely want liquid memories. That one's gonna save me I feel like all of those could save me. The random attack one is like maybe two energy is more important than a random attack card It just depends though. Sometimes the attack cards do nice things like draw cards All right, YOLO, let's go. We probably don't need two fires I think we only need one because we have an item that's I heal 25 HP at the start of a boss combat. Let's see how much we get bodied by this fight and then we'll decide if we need the fire or not. Fading, shifting, 999, nine. what the fuck is this shit? Uh, upon losing HP, loses that much strength. Dies in, okay, so I have to survive for five turns. Whew, this is just a survival fight, whoa. Upon losing HP, loses that much strength. Okay, so I have to hurt it though to make it deal less damage. That's interesting. Um, well, I'm kind of interested in applying Neutralize to it because that likes, that lowers its attack all the way down to 16. That's good. Um, let's see. Draw one, discard one. Let's see what we get. Cause that's gonna lower its attack again down to 12, which is really nice. Ooh, nice. Okay, we can use that one for free. Let's just get rid of one of these defends. Probably want to cast Noxious. No, Noxious fumes. Ah, uh, I'm not sure if it will. Let me read this exactly. Upon losing HP, loses that much strength on the end of turn. Poison damage applies during its turn. I, I'm trying to figure out if this is going to be useful for ramping damage reduction on it. It could be. It could be, if we poison it a bunch. Um, 
Okay, question. I think we want to use Sneaky Strike. Well, this is interesting. Maybe I save Sneaky Strike. Hard to figure out exactly what I want to do this turn. Let's use Sneaky Strike. Or do I save Sneaky Strike? save acrobatics and sticky strike for next turn because all i have to do is survive this is all about survival so if i'm just trying to prepare and survive as much as possible assuming noxious fumes will ramp it will continuously add to its poison and then cause damage reduction then um i'm pretty good that just i'm pretty good with just using deflect or maybe even well, I want to make sure I draw up to 10 cards next turn, so let's use that. And then I think we just poison it, and then we let the poison start cooking. And hopefully it works the way I want it to work. I have 7 block right now. This will take its damage down to... Oh, the poison... Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens with poison. It's 3 poison. I'm hoping that that applies the strength debuff, because it does say damage specifically on it. It says, upon losing HP. So it's going to take poison damage, lose HP, and then it should get... Shot. Yeah, okay, cool, cool. Good. So it won't hurt us. Okay, now it deals 40 damage, so I'm assuming, I see how this is going to go. I see how this is going to go here. We're gonna have to, maybe we should keep out maneuver then. We'll see though. So I wanna make sure I just have to negate its damage every turn here. Ramping a ton of poison will help with that. 40 is already a lot. <laughs> 40 is already a lot. Um, all right, are we gonna have to discard a card this turn? I have acrobatics twice. Let's use this deflect. And I think I'm gonna have to use acrobatics here in order to discard a card so that I can sneaky strike it. Applying a whole lot of poison to it will be beneficial the whole time though, so that sounds good. Um, let's use outmaneuver in the assumption that next turn we're gonna need even more help. I don't want to use too much. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, that would be a mistake. I need to use acrobatics first. Yeah, I need to use acrobatics first. I know your hand is full, I'm sorry. Um, all about defense. Next, ooh, burst will be very helpful here. Yeah, burst is gonna be very helpful. Defend is worse than simply hitting it for seven. So let's get rid of defend. Okay, now I can cast Sneaky Strike for free, which we desperately need right now. All right, that takes it down to 27. I would love to play Metamorphosis or something just to get some good shit coming up for free, but it's very difficult when it's swinging into my face for 27. Um. Deal 13 damage, draw a card. I feel like we need to just kind of hit it with some of these guys. If we can use out maneuver, great, but I'm not sure if we can or not. Let's just slash it. And we'll see if we can use out maneuver or not. Oh, it reduces the cost of one. So we'll be able to play Metamorphosis soon with that. Um, do I want to take seven or do I want to try Do I want to take seven and get out maneuver going for next turn? I think it's probably better to just negate all of its damage and then we'll keep trying to cook next turn. Oh, but I've got eight cards in my hand. What can I do with burst? So much with burst. Oh my God, burst without maneuver. It's gonna be hot. For the final turn, burst out maneuver could really save my ass. Um. I'm tempted to just play Metamorphosis and take 7 damage here. Hard to know, though. Hard to know. I have so many acrobatics in my hand. Let's go for just taking no damage this turn. And we're only going to draw 3 cards, though, is an issue with that, but... Alright, this could this could backfire. 
Oh, I forgot about the poison. I wouldn't have taken so much because of the poison. All right. Here comes 50, but that's okay. Neutralize is going to seriously help that out this turn. We could consider even saving Neutralize, but I feel like at this point we just take it turn by turn here. Uh, we need to plan ahead a little bit, though. Almost certainly going to just do Enlightenment and Metamorphosis so that we can cook later. Yeah, I think we'll apply weak to it this turn, and then we'll work on... We'll work on cooking for later here. Because Enlightenment and Metamorphosis is going to really help us out later. Really, really, really help us out later. Nice. We have a Sneaky Strike. And we can use... Uh... Burst Out Maneuver would be nice here. Actually, yeah. I think we use Prepared. Oh, this is tough, actually. If I use Prepared, I can Sneaky Strike for free, then that'll mostly deal with it this turn. Hmm. Let's see what we draw. Oh, Phantasmal Killer will be really good for a final blow here, too. Um, all right. Defend is just never going to be worth it, I don't think, in this fight. And Survival isn't great either, because I can do more than eight damage for the most part, and it discards a card. So it's better, I think, to just hit it. I gotta decide now how we're gonna play the next few turns. Let's start with this. So that takes it. Oh, why didn't that? Oh, cause it's only cause of weak the way weak works. Well, it's gonna have five damage taken off of it from poison ramping too. Um, however, I don't have any block yet, so I think we're still gonna have to do something here. We could use acrobatics and see what we draw. Hmm. Um. Or backflip and see what we draw. Both are okay, I think. Probably backflip. Yeah, this was good. This is good. And then we could just deadly poison it, and that's going to really help us later on. It's, okay, we'll play Phantasmal Killer for next round. And then apply deadly poison to it. We'll draw five cards. It'll take 12 poison damage, which reduces its damage even more. And then we'll draw five. Okay, we're not going to take too much damage here. I don't know exactly how much with the whole weight with the way weakened works, but okay, we'll take like 10 damage. That's okay. Woo, and here comes 60. <laughs> but we do double damage this turn, so that should really help us out. And now we have a lot of our ramping stuff coming up here, so. Let's card one card at random. Maybe we'll use that later. There's a lot of interesting ways we can play this now. Hmm. We're going to definitely want to play Burst and Outmaneuver for next turn, I think. Your next two skills are played twice. So I think we want to Deadly Poison it twice for sure. Hmm. Um, it would be nice to... Do I have any draw? I have all these acrobatics, but my hand size is already a little bit nuts. It's going to lose 13 of its attack from poison damage, but it's still doing 60, which is a lot. Um, hard to know what to do here, like the right order. Burst Deadly Poison feels good, because it's just going to help no matter what. The problem with that is that then I'm kind of running out of stuff to do. I think I'm going to do it though. Burst Deadly Poison. 27 poison is just going to be really, really helpful. Now, I think I use Deflect and All Out Attack and see what it discards. I could use... I really wanted to cast out Maneuver. Is it safe, though? I need to make sure I don't die accidentally here. <sighs> 22 damage. That's going to take out most of it. I think I'm safe to... To use out maneuver twice here. God, how many turns do I have? Dies in two turns. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, a little bit rough here. Okay, 22 damage. We'll take it. We'll make it deal 38 
damage. That's how I do math, right? That'll make it do 38 damage. Then it will lose 27 of that damage from poison. So it'll only deal 11 damage. So it probably means I should use a deflect. Mm, I'm gonna use Al Maneuver. Why did I draw a card exactly? I think I missed something there. I'm gonna use, oh God, I wanna use all out attack, but if I discard something really good, it's gonna really annoy me. Um. Oh yeah, the ink bottle. Whenever you play 10 cards, draw one. Okay, cool. I could use this instead, but it feels like I wanna use this next turn instead. I should be safe to just use this. If it discards violence, I'll be sad, but it, it's okay. Yeah, if it discards violence, that would be really, really unfortunate. But that's okay. I think we just go for that. Thank fuck. One acrobatics is okay. All right. <laughs> if I needed to, I could panic use this, but I think it's gonna be okay because it's gonna take 27 poison damage, meaning it's only gonna deal 11 to me and I'm gonna block seven of that 11. So it's only gonna hit me for four, which ain't bad. And I'll draw five new cards. Okay. And it only did one because of Tori. All right, jeez. Now I don't know if it dies or if it's gonna hit me for 80 too. I don't know exactly what I need to prepare for here. Mm. I really wish I had drawn um, Terror already. Terror would really help me here. dies this turn okay so I'm hoping this is the last turn I have nine energy we should just be able to kill it pretty easy here uh, quick slash nine damage draw a card yeah <laughs> um, lots of good things to do here I don't want to play unload though <laughs> I don't want to play unload be careful with that one Some more card draw soon would be nice here. I think I'm gonna get rid of four plot just to get some cards out of my hand. And then I can just use these for zero later. They're not gonna help me right now. Yeah, that's good. And then I can play either violence or acrobatics. I'll play violence. Yeah, cause I'm gonna get a lot of zero casting costs. Nice. Distraction. Doppelganger. Next turn! That's not helpful right now. Um, let's see. We're gaming! <laughs> Alright. At some point, I want to play acrobatics, but I want to do a few things first here. But what? Um, I have nine energy. Let's just use some of these strikes. All right, now let's use acrobatics. And then let's discard. Oh, I should have done one more. Let's discard tactician. Finally, I get terror. Um, but I think we're good. I think we're just good. It's down to 18 damage, and it's gonna take 28 poison damage. So I think we're already good. <laughs> Malays it for seven. <laughs> Dies this turn. Uh, all right, take twenty million strength loss. I don't need to do anything else to it. Can't hurt me. Dead. Whew. Okay. I was hoping it was gonna actually die there. Man, I keep getting these potions. Um, add four ships to your hand. Holy crap. That's an interesting ability. If you have some reason to use a lot of cards, this would be useful. Or you could use them as uh, discard fodder, too. Just 10 damage to all enemies. Discard one card at random. Don't love that. Slice. Zero for nine. This isn't bad. This ain't bad. Let's do it. Uh, energy. 
energy potion. All right, I'm gonna say drop the attack potion and just take an energy potion. Cause energy potion could help me combo if I seriously need to. Um, I think we're gonna just, do we just go for one campfire or do we play it safe and do two campfires? I think we play it safe and do two campfires. Cause if I don't need the second one, if I don't need the second one, then I'll just smith. So we'll rest for now. And if I don't need the other one, then we just smith. Oh my goodness. So are these guys lifelink? <laughs> yes, yeah, so we want to kill these all at once. Sneaky strike. Do we have a discard in our hand right now? That's the important thing. I think we don't, sadly. But we can try distraction and see what it does. Start with distraction. John, do you have six cards in your hand? Um, can we get down that much? All right, let's neutralize you. So you do less damage to us. We can... Play enlightenment so that sneaky strike, but it doesn't matter if you haven't discarded a card. Yeah, darn. I don't see that. I don't see this working out super well. Alas, maybe we save that then, and we just defend and do some poison or something. Let's use defend. A play noxious fumes. That's really good against these guys. And then, um... Maybe we just start getting some poison rolling. We are gonna take a little damage, but that's okay. Let's poison you. And we'll bank on next turn. This is my second run ever. We just started playing the game today. Uh, oh my goodness. All right, we got a lot of good stuff coming in here. Uh, do I have a discard though? We're kind of lacking a discard. So much draw until I have stuff, but nothing to discard. Um, At least we can Use deflect. Get some of that. Ooh! Gosh. That's right. Whenever you play 10 cards, draw a card. Mm. Um. <laughs> well, this is a little bit awkward. I'm not going to lie. We're kind of oversaturated on. I need to, like, get rid of these strikes from my deck or something. Um. Yeah. No discard. To poison you. I think we're kind of banking on next turn, which is not optimal, given the amount of damage these things are slowly dealing to us. I don't really want to use any potions on these guys, though. And we can outmaneuver for next turn. I think we just use outmaneuver for next turn. Too many expertise, unfortunately. Not a, can't play enough cards to get to them, really. We have maneuver for next turn. I guess I should have used Quick Slash. You know what? I should have used Quick Slash because it might have given me... I might have just drawn something nice with it. These stupid strikes are annoying. Okay, um, so it does have nine poison. I think we're just gonna have to take a little bit of damage here. And that should be okay, because we regenerate 25 uh, for the boss fight. All right, hopefully we get some discard. Nope. <laughs> oh my gosh, well we have enough energy now to at least do things. Let's start using, let's start by using backflip. Oh no, no, because I need to get rid of something. Gosh. 
I'm just going to use Enlightenment to get this card out of my hand, and hopefully I don't immediately draw something that I wanted to do with that. Let's use Backflip. Okay. Forethought could be useful here, actually. Yeah, Forethought is going to really be useful with Expertise. I think. Um, let's use Deflect. Alright, we've already got a good amount of block. So... At least won't take any damage this turn. Uh, how's the best way to play this? They're all getting a bunch of poison. We need to hit the one on the right a little bit. Uh, Forethought could be an interesting play. I'm kind of tempted to do it. Yeah, I'm kind of tempted to do it. Let's use Forethought. I put a whole bunch of this crap that I don't want to use right now, like one of these one of these expertise. Um, now it's a question of do I want to play expertise or do I want to play violence? I think I'll play expertise, and I will just put a whole lot of shit on the bottom. And then let's play expertise. All right. Finally, an acrobatics. Uh, cool. We can play some. We can play sneaky strike with that. All right. Good. Mm, maybe get rid of this strike. Yeah. Yeah, I really like forethought and expertise. All right. This is looking better here. Definitely, just want to make sure I'm not taking too much any extra damage anymore. Uh. Let's get Terra on this one, because I feel like it's one of the harder ones. Oh, nice! And then we got Tactician. All right, now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. Let's be prepared. Mm. Discard Tactician. Um, I don't think I need the defense this turn. Or do I? Wait, maybe I do. Wait, wait, maybe I do. No, I can play Survivor. Would I rather play Survivor? Yeah, I'll play Survivor. All right. Um, nice. It'd be nice to play Metamorphosis if we can, or maybe we can just win. That'd be cool too. We'll see. I want to make sure I get a little bit more damage negation in, but I also want to just deal damage and draw cards. So, Let's see what we draw here. Defend. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna play Survivor and discard Defend just so I don't have to think about that anymore. Now I have enough blocks so that I don't have to think anymore and I could just play cards. I really like the idea of Metamorphosis followed by Violence. So let's do that. And then let's play Violence and maybe we're just gonna get a whole bunch of good cards. Yeah, even getting Sticky Strike is good. This is a net gain of two energy. So... Um... Let's hit this one. Yeah, that's a net gain of two energy. Heck yeah. All right, if the enemy is weak, can I apply weak? Don't have it on me right now. Never punished. Uh, oops. Um, sneaky strike you. Oh, I do have weak. Dag nab it. Oh, I didn't use I didn't use it yet. All right, let's put weak on you, and then let's use heal hook to draw a card. Ooh, burst! <laughs> burst acrobatics! <laughs> oh man, burst acrobatics is a fun one. Burst acrobatics. Oh, uh, let's get rid of strike. Nice. Get rid of malaise. All right, we should just be able to kill them. Deals 11 damage to all enemies. Yep, we're just gonna be able to kill them all. All right, that's already gonna finish the first two with their poison, so we're good here. We're good here. We'll just, how much, all right, zero casting cost. So let's do you. And then we're good on all that attack. That's already good enough to finish them off. They have enough poison to, oh, this one needs one more hit. Um, die. All right, they die to the poison. Whew, all right, nice. 
Sneko oil. Draw five cards, randomize the cost. Oh my gosh. Maybe that comes in handy, but also maybe that fucks me. Um, an extra terror could be good. Whenever you draw this card, add a copy of it into your hand. <laughs> more prepared. I feel like I have enough prepared, but then I'm always like, I could have more. This is my only way of applying vulnerable, and vulnerable really matters a lot, so... It feels like it might be nice to get a second one of these. Or I'm going to draw it twice and then rage. Do I take the Sneckle Oil? Upgrades all cards. The upgrade all cards might not be as good as I think, because so many of these are already upgraded. If it has a plus on it, I'll take an answer to this question. If it has a plus on it, and all of my skills have a plus on it, will this not affect them? Does Blessing of the Forge not affect something that already has a plus on it? Okay, I think I'm going to get rid of Blessing of the Forge then. Because I have so many things that already are upgraded. Alright, let's take the Sneko Oil and get rid of the Blessing of the Forge. <laughs> the Sneko Oil might screw me, but it also might save me. So I'll gain 25 HP when I start the boss fight. Uh, which will put me at 71. Which is close to max. So I could take the upgrade here. Maybe I will. Instead of it's just five extra HP. Let's take the upgrade. Uh, what's what would be nice to upgrade? A week for two turns is very nice. Um, extra poison is really nice. Gosh, I really should have. I wish I could have gotten rid of more of these cards. Um, it just does a little bit extra damage. The extra turn of week is nice. Cause it saves my ass to some extent. Content oil, yeah, exactly. Either that or noxious fume fumes. I do start with noxious fumes in my hand, so fuck it, let's do that. Let's upgrade that noxious fumes. All right, chat, uh, I have to feed my cat. And then we'll do it. Let's see if we can beat this boss this time. We uh, died to this boss on our last run, which was our first ever run. See what we can do. We got it. We got annihilated last time. To the boss. This is not the same boss. Oh man, this is different. What are you guys? Well, oh, they're cool. I like them. Evil donut. <laughs> Cosmic do donut. Donu. <laughs> Deca. Oh, a dodecahedron and a donut. <laughs> I love the the character design or like enemy design. This is great. They're very silly. I love them. This is wonderful. Oh my god! All right. Um. Well, we can start off with a nice distraction. It's only gonna do ten times two, but it's also gonna inflict a negative effect. It's a little bit annoying. It's gonna be. They're gonna negate two poisons, but that's okay. Let's start with distraction, I think, or maybe. No, none of those are boss. Okay, cool. Let's start with distraction then and see what we get. Dodge and roll. That's okay. I don't have a dex potion, right? Yeah, I don't have a dex potion. Looks like we're going to mostly just prepare for next turn here. Um, Let's see. We can also try drawing a card with this and see how it goes. We have four energy. If nothing else, we can play out maneuver and knock fumes and get ready for next round. Mm. But let's see if we can draw something with quick slash. The only downside of doing this is I have so many cards in my hand, it would be nice to get rid of some though. So that is a downside. It just depends on what I draw, I suppose. You know what? I definitely want to play this. I definitely want to play this. Maybe I just play dodge and roll. It's 10 times two. Um. Oh, YOLO, let's see what I draw. Quick slash, great. <laughs> great. Let's play out maneuver. Or maybe I just play noxious fumes, defend. 
Yeah, I think I play... I want to get 15 because... Um, if I can get the second attack down to... Um, five... Then my Tori will make it one. So, as much as I'd like to play Outmaneuver... I think I'm just going to play Noxious Fumes, Defend, and Dodge. Hard to say. But not, our maneuver might come back to bite me by not playing it next turn. Ah, let's just take the extra. Oh no, it'll be 10 extra damage though, won't it? Yeah, it'll be quite a bit of extra damage. Let's just use Noxious Fumes. Uh, oh, I drew another card, but it didn't matter. Too bad it wasn't a cheap defense. Um, I think dodge and roll. Dodge roll for sure. And then it's just a question of do we play defend so that this only does one damage to us? I think we do. And we bank on outmaneuver in the future here. Or I could pop the two energy and just YOLO it. But I don't know what these guys are going to do. I don't know what these guys are going to do. Uh, no back seating right now because this is my first day ever playing it. So just let me struggle. <laughs> let me struggle. I'll ask questions though if I do want an answer. I don't know what this is going to do. Intense to use above. Yeah, I wish I hadn't used the Quick Slash in retrospect. The Quick Slash just made this... I should have just used both of these instead of the Quick Slash, but it's too late now. I'll use Defend, keep our, da keep our health up right now, and then we'll bank on these things if we super need them later. I mean, I'm tempted to use the... I could use the Energy Potion. Play out maneuver, play deadly poison to get some poison cooking on it. And then I'll draw extra cards as the bonus of doing it that way. You know what? I'm gonna use the energy potion, play out maneuver for next turn, and then get poison cooking on it. Oh, it's not gonna actually go. Wait a second. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh! The poison isn't gonna actually hit it. Well, we'll just pretend that I didn't do that. Whoops. I'm thinking that the negative status effects will wear off just from the... Ah, fuck it. This will wear it off faster. Alright, suboptimal. That's okay. It's my first run. Uh, so Mary says, Hi Carl, this is a nice game for sure. Looking forward to your experience. We recently played it for the first time. It was fun to explore. Heck yeah. Ooh, they gained a bunch of strength. Alright. Well, the good news is, is... Now we have a lot of stuff to do. A lot of stuff to do. Depends on which one I want to apply this to. Like, I don't really know which one I want to kill first here. This one's gonna buff. I do have some discard, which is good. I'm gonna focus my attacks on this one right now, just because the other one's already damaged. Oh, it does. <laughs> Fuck! Stupid chat. I'm stupid. Um. Okay, alignment's gonna be good though. Well, on the plus side, I can apply this to it now, so that's good actually to some extent. I can apply my lace to it at the end. That is good, though, to reduce its damage. Um, all right, we might be able to do a lot here, though, just depending on how we want to play this. I've got seven energy. I need to just start using stuff. Let's just start hitting it. Let's see what I draw. Okay, acrobatics. We're going to need to use an acrobatics here. Um, I already have ten block. If I use malaise on it, I think the weak will make it so I don't need any additional block. Because I have the thing that makes weak do 40% already, which is great. Um, so... I wish I could malaise it for one. For, with, when it says X, um, does that mean that it takes all remainder, or can I choose the amount? Because I would just choose it for one and cast it right now if I could. I don't think it works that way though, right? Um, a group of thieves stole a shipment of Viagra. <laughs> Police, <laughs> it takes all remaining. The police ought to look out for a group of hardened criminals. All right. Um, in that case, I shall strike you. And then I shall play acrobatics because then I'll go down to six cards, drop to ten. Get rid of one of these strikes. Probably. Well, I don't need to defend this turn. Get rid of this turn. Okay, I can gain back some energy now with Sneaky Strike if I use Enlightenment. 
And I think that's the way I want to play this here. Yeah. Let's use Sneaky Strike now to gain some energy. Backflip. Draw two cards, gain some block. We do like to see that. Um, this is good. To what extent do I want to... Well, let's see what cards we get. Let's draw two cards. Oh, good. We can apply Vulnerable again. I wonder if I should try killing them at the same time. I don't know. Don't know how that's going to play out. Let's put Terror on this one simply because the other one's higher health by a little bit. Uh, Alright. We're looking good now, though. We're looking good. Let's slice it. And now let's play Acrobatics. And do we do need to discard something? Probably a strike here? Anything better to discard it. Let's discard strike. Okay. But I would probably like to play Metamorphosis. Um, let's prep, let's do prepare just in. Oh, maybe I should save one of these though. Uh, there's so many nice cards I could draw though. Yeah, like Tactician. There we go. That's why we play that. Let's discard Tactician. Hmm. Probably just a strike here. Save the block for later, maybe. Alright, we're cooking a little bit. I do want to play Metamorphosis for sure. Yeah, die, die, die. Alright, nice. Let's get some nice cards in our deck. I think I can mostly just finish this turn. But let's poison you, because poison won't affect... Poison won't be affected by Vulnerable anyway, so let's get the poison ramping on you. Let's save our deflect. We don't need any more this turn. And ideally we want to apply we want to apply one or two more cards here. Let's um I'm gonna poison you this time though. And then probably use malaise and call it a day. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna use malaise and call it a day here. So you do less damage now. Alright, I think that's I'm happy with that turn. And then we're gonna draw a whole bunch of cards the next turn. Let's see what they do. And then the poison's ramping. They got 16 shields each, and it's not gonna hurt me. All right, here we go. Oh, Phantasmal Killer. I was hoping to get that one last time. A buff and some negative effects and that. Okay, I wonder if the negative effect still applies. Let's get Phantasmal Killer cooking here. Let's weaken this one. Yeah, let's weaken you. Got two additional cards next turn. I mean, that's pretty sweet. Uh, deal five damage for each skill you have in your hand. Oh, I probably should make sure I don't use any skills. Okay, flying knee is good. Let's flying knee you. All right, we got through that one's shield. I do like how we're poisoning the heck out of him, too. Honestly, I can almost play my whole hand <laughs> and then play Expertise, but I'm not sure if it's better to do that this turn or next turn. Um, let's get this out of my hand. I do still need to block somewhat this turn, so we draw two additional cards next turn. That's going to be nice next turn. Five damage. Yeah, let's do that one. Um, just don't know if I should try killing them all at once or kill it or keeping them separate. At this rate, it feels like it's still gonna hit me seven twice, so I may as well just deflect it and cast expertise. Let's get six more cards. Ooh, we're at the bottom of the deck and can start using Foresight to Forethought, which is really nice. I could just Forethought, like, my whole hand. <laughs> and then, because next time we're going to do double damage, so... Um... But I have another Expertise in the deck, don't I? Or did I already use it? Oh, I don't have it. But I could grab it. There's some crazy shit I could do right now. All right, I could Forethought my whole hand, maybe except for Violence or something. And then I could use Liquid Memories to go to the discard pile and get Expertise, and then just like redraw freaking everything with Acrobatics. 
But... I kind of want to do it next turn when I have double damage. Uh, Mr. Sinistar says, Carl, I appreciate your videos and personality. You're an awesome person that makes me want to be better. The more you know... Aw, thank you, Mr. Sinistar. I appreciate that. This is very fun. And also very hard to play optimally. Very hard to play this optimally. I have 14 block. That's enough to cancel out all that damage. So maybe we just wait for next turn here. Have I not discarded a card this turn? Wild. Uh, I think I'm gonna just wait. I'm gonna use maybe two cards and then play for next turn. isn't going to come in as handy as I wanted it to, I don't think. Even though we're close to the bottom of the deck. But I think I want to just... I already have a bunch of zero costs in there anyway, so... I think I just want to draw a bunch of cards, use acrobatics, and then play violence, and then just do a ton of double damage attacks next turn. Oh, I drew my extra card accidentally. Oopsies. Um... Do I want to play Sucker Punch? I think that's good to keep, keep to keep that. In case they do a lot of damage, I might need to apply a weak next turn. I'm just gonna keep that. I kinda just wanna keep my hand. It's also good. Yeah. Alright, poison is ramping. Alright, dazed is okay. So this is my discard. So they're gonna start doing more damage. That's okay. Alright, my hand is full. I'm sorry. All right, I want to get back to the rest of my deck, I think, so that then I can use violence. But we're doing double damage right now, so... So we do want to think about how to do that. My weak. It would be nice to apply... Um... <laughs> Burst violence! Oh my gosh! Um, let's use some cards that are zero, since those are the easiest to use. Apply two turns of weak to that one. That's useful. There's only two cards left in the deck. Let's play acrobatics. Die, die, die. Let's get rid of that dazed. Deals 20 damage to all enemies. Nice. Does that count the double that I already have? Yeah, it does count the double. That's why it's so much. Alright. Um, 20 damage to all enemies. That sounds good. Sneaky Strike is free. So we have a free sneaky strike. It might be a good idea since I don't need the defense necessarily right now to play prepared first and see what we get. Nice, let's get rid of these defense and then probably the survivor too. Just use dodge and roll if I want that. All right, 26 damage to our card. We can't say no to that. I wonder if I should focus on killing one of them, or if they're gonna- You don't know if it's gonna have a, a rage mechanic or something, you know? Like, I don't know what it's gonna do. So that's why I'm like a little bit suspicious about suddenly walking into an enrage mechanic. Uh, but I do a lot more damage to that one. Nice! I was hoping to get this card. Enlightenment is great here. Um, because... Well, it gives me a little bit of extra energy here. We'll see if I need it. It just depends on what I draw with violence, I guess. Let's use Sneaky Strike. I'm just gonna finish this one off and hope, I guess. Thirty-nine damage to this one, though. Oh, gotta just—I can't say no to that. We do have burst here. Burst violence. <laughs> Neutralize first. Put a third turn of weak on that one. Oh my gosh, acrobatics though. Do I burst violence or burst acrobatics? Burst violence. 
Or can I? Yeah, your next two skills are played twice. Let's play burst. Let's play violence. <laughs> and then these sneaky strikes are like literally net gain. All right, we're finishing that one off. Let's see how this goes. Stalker punch is free. Let's do that. God, this deck is sick. <laughs> this deck is so sick. 20 damage, draw a card. Oh my god. Discard one of these strikes. Alright, um... I think I want to play Acrobatics in hopes of getting a uh, Weekend to put on it or something. Or heck, you never know. Maybe I'll get a bunch of defense. Oops. <laughs> it's okay. I'll maneuver Rahal. Ooh! Oh, we may as well use prepared then. Oh, <laughs> we're just chaining our whole deck at this point. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, I need to discard two cards. I've got better stuff to use in these strikes. It's got 86 life still, but it's going to take 11 poison damage. Um, no, Ruby went back. All right, we should be able to win this. They should be able to win those. Or at least very close here. I think all I've got now, because I don't really want the block, I think I'm just going to apply a bunch of deadly poison to it. Yeah, 14 damage and 3 more poison. Let's do that. Oh my gosh. But I think we're out of energy here now. So we'll do double damage next turn. Um, we may as well negate all its damage here. And then I think I'm going to cast out Maneuver just in case it dicks me with some special phase two that I don't know about. Yeah, in case I get dicked by random phase two, let's just, let's just put that on. Oh, this boss feels so much easier than the other one or else this character is just broken. It doesn't even seem like it has a phase two. Where, why did the other one have this horrible phase two? 10 damage for each skill in your hand. This is just 50 damage to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Let's go! That was way a way easier boss, I feel like. Yeah, having block really helped, didn't it? Whew! This deck is cool. Really cool. A deep pulsing dread can be felt throughout the room. Is this the heart of the spire? I wonder if there's only gonna be four acts. Prepare your dagger? Oh, what? You prepare your daggers? All I can do is click attack. Look at that, there's a little dice back there. <laughs> you deal 700 damage, the heart squirms, but it's always still pounding. Your mightiest attack's not enough. Have I been here before? <laughs> you feel that you have dealt 741 damage to the heart, a total of 14 uh, billion damage has been dealt by all who have challenged it that's the game there's no act four what ascension unlocked C -c 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 combo play 20 cards in a single turn what it does say question mark all right um unlock oh cards unlocked we got extra poison cards deal seven damage enemy has poison deal seven again Oof. <laughs> uh double the enemy's poison <laughs> shit apply six poison when the enemy dies deal damage equal to its max hp to all enemies whoa corpse explosion that sounds cool We got a new character as well. Yay. I don't know what that is. Crystal friend. Okay. We got credits on our second one. What the heck? We'll take it. All right. <laughs> Robot friend. It's your favorite. I'll try that one next. Is that really the game? I want more. Click again to exit. Is there anything worth watching here? Or is it just names? Did 
Just names. All right. Let's see what happens next. I see. So we've beaten the game with that one character, which lit up that. And I'm assuming the other two characters, or there's apparently only three characters, would need to be done to do the other thing. Okay. Um, so if I do standard, well, there's still this one. Winning a standard run after having unlocked the third character. We gotta try the next character this time, the defect. A combat automaton which became self-aware. Ancient technology allows the manipulation of ores. At the start of each combat, channel one lightning. Ooh, all right, this one sounds fun. Um, our friend Bobby this game took me hard was and I one-shot it. You still remember to this day. Let's go, Dan, let's go. <laughs> Orb. All right, um, well, I'm going to have to leave it there for today, but this was tons of fun. Thanks for coming out, everybody. So um, I just ask, um, do I want to keep playing standard mode? Is that like the best? Would, would you recommend that for whatever I do next? Okay, we'll keep doing this. So we'll play with the defect next time. See what other cool decks we can make. Thanks, Dinarg. Sanders the default. The rest added for replayability. Okay, so we'll keep doing that until we've uh, beaten it with all the. Let's try beating it with all the characters. That sounds fun. Uh, Justin Borton, thank you for the two months. Monster Bash, thank you for the sub. Thank you, Gigglemancer. Thank you, Footsher Frog. Thank you, Thab. Thank you, T Slav. Thank you, Ludes. Thank you, Sushi Cat. Oh, yeah, I missed. It's greatly appreciated. Thanks for coming out, everybody. This was really, really, really fun. What an awesome game. I want to play more roguelikes. Hmm. I don't know what roguelike to play next. I'm thinking Noida? 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 Or there's a bunch of other card roguelikes that I would love to play too. Thanks, Dark Link. You kicked that donut's butt. That car that deck was cool. There's a Twitch extension for this? Oh, interesting dynamite. Thank you. I like that idea. You have a ton left of this one. Alright, cool. We'll keep doing it. I'm having a great time. Bye, everybody.